charm. <laughs> Welcome to the powerful Comics Man Podcast. Maayong gabi. Maayong gabi sa mga kaibigan. Uh, so, <laughs> let's just check. Okay, here we go. May, may uh, audio na tayo. And, uh, pangatlong beses. <laughs> okay na yung kanina, okay na yung una eh. Tapos ngayon, but then, never mind. Um, welcome to the Powerful Comics Man Podcast. Um, as I was saying kanina, dalawang beses ko nang nasabi, um, the first time pa lang, the very first time na uh, I even entertained or even dreamed about doing this podcast, the person right beside me is... Uh, one of the first people that came into my mind na parang, oh shit, imagine mo, Pinoy podcast, nandun siya, di ba? Nandun, among other people, like uh, Dr. Rainer Reyes and uh, uh, some previous guests and some other guests that uh, I still dream and one day I hope to have here in the podcast. Uh, but uh, for now, this is a dream come true to have this man uh, do the show with me. It's a great pleasure, a great honor uh, for me uh, as uh, an amateur podcaster. Uh, also, um, we have a giveaway from Comic Odyssey. Um, they are sponsoring another giveaway. Um, this is uh, a trade paperback um, by uh, by uh, the my guest. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to retrieve. Di ko nakuha yung yung uh, book before the show started. So, sayang, hindi niya masasign. Pero at least you'll, you're gonna have it. At uh, pag nakita niyo siya sa mga convention, pa, nandyan niya nang well, pwede, pwede niya pasign. Mm-hmm. Sabihin niyo kayo yung nanalo dati, di ba? <laughs> so, yun. Uh, and also, this this show is brought to you by Mucha Lux Cakes at hello.mucha uh, on Instagram. Check niyo, yun yung super lipit naming uh, teka, tingnan natin. Meron yata akong promo dito. Yun! Yan! Ha! Huh. Yan. Mucha Lux Cakes. Punta nyo sa Instagram. At hello.mucha. Uh, we have cookies. We have... Ay, bigla akong nagbenta ng cookies, no? Okay, no? Okay din ako, eh. O, sige. Game. Game na. <laughs> Without further ado. Uh, super, super... Uh, like I said, very honored to have this... Uh, this... Uh, tremendous artist... Pinaka, ano, I think one of, uh, no, I think the brightest among Pinoy super, uh, comic superstars, Mr. Lionel Yu. <laughs> Hello. Hello. What's up? What's hey, up, man. guys? <laughs> so, uh, yun. So, what's up? 17, 17 na nanonood sa atin. Yeah. Okay, okay. Thank Ito you sa so lahat ng nanonood. Please share this, uh, this uh, episode. Super, ano, um... <clears throat> Sana matulungan nyo kaming i-share to kasi uh, basta we're gonna <laughs> basta i-share nyo. <laughs> okay, game, game. Game. Uh, so, uh, <laughs> Lainil, um, like, ayusin lang natin yung mga ano, mga some technical shit. <laughs> Cut. Lagyan natin. Okay, para maganda. Okay, so, uh, First of all, um, ano, ano, ano muna natin pag-usapan? <laughs> Teka, may notes ako eh. <laughs> Pero, Siyempre, uh, unahin na muna natin sa simula, no? Mm. Para, let's uh, talk about your beginnings as a, as a comic book artist. Mm-hmm. Para lang, ito lang, parang bahaba naman tayo dito, eh, uh. di ba? So, f- so uh, anong klaseng, what are the things that inspired you? What are, what is, how did your journey start? Uh, well, I've been drawing all my life, and as far as I can remember, before I even, um, before I was able to to write the ABCs, I remember drawing around you know the A B C D E F G and not with before finishing it, I drawing na ako sa mga oh, so, sa paligid. So frustrated yung yung tutor ko or yung yung yaya ko during that time. Mm-hmm. Bata pa ako, mulit pa ako. So even before before makapagsulat, um, nag the drawing na ako and um, th- there's always imagination involved. Um, I remember I was drawing scenes, ganun, ganun. but mm-hmm. I grew up drawing um, um, cartoons, mostly 80s cartoons and mo- mo- a lot of Japanese cartoons, but they weren't called anime back, back then. then no? Yeah, I, I was more bold as five. And uh, I mean, Transformers is Japanese, mm. and then Mac- uh, Robotech, Macross, and all that stuff, mm-hmm. and Ghostbusters, and 
So I was more into animation than comic books because I didn't have access um, to comic books during that time, and I only had you know uh, a few. Um, and then I got my hands on how to draw comics the Marvel way when I was like eleven. Okay. Um, yeah, so I started, you know, practicing that. I was trying to copy John Busima. John Busima, so yeah, Stanley, yeah, yeah, no? yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. and it, it it tremendously helped me a lot. I was no so eleven, ball. Yeah, yeah, I was eleven, and um, yeah. So yeah, I just kept drawing. I've been yeah, as I've said, I drew every day during class, mm-hmm. during tests. And uh, I just kept drawing. And then Will Spartasho came um, to promote X-Men. And so I was in- inspired by him. Mm-hmm. But I, d- I didn't expect to be to be part of the studios years later. So um, ah, so this is before he came <clears throat> and set up the studio? Before he, came, he before he set up the studio, he came to Manila and promoted the X-Men. Mm-hmm. I, was, I was really blown away. I was like, wow. I think he showed like a Jim Lee uh, spread mm-hmm. on TV. And oh, okay. uh, yeah, he promoted it. Parang one of the one of the one of our um, um, uh, showbiz uh, talk, uh, talk shows. He mm-hmm. was there because he probably he, he knew. I think Atejo was there. His his his, um, his uh, wife and um, oh, yeah. Okay. So <laughs> so I, I think that's how I remember it. And then years uh, fast forward a few years, he set up a studio, mm-hmm. and you know he got some guys. He got uh, Jerry Allen Gillan. He got Roy Allen Martinez. And a few, uh, a few other, uh, a lot, many other guys, and um, I was one of the guys who he took under his wing. Maybe um, a year after he, he put up the studio, upon Jerry's insistence and, mm-hmm. and recommendation, because uh-huh. you know I, I submitted my work, but it was like a poor copy of Wills's. So, okay. so yeah. I don't know, diba, sab- <clears throat> yun yung yeah. parang. Uh, <clears throat> Uh, I'm sure you don't mind anymore. Mm. <laughs> Pero yun na sabi dati before na mm. parang yung your your style used oh, to yeah, be yeah. a lot uh, uh, very similar with uh, with the Sportacho. Yeah, it was oh, yeah. Looking back, it was pretty bad actually. It was, <laughs> it was a bad copy. Before then, actually, I I did an issue of Aster for Entity Comics. Mm-hmm. Um, so um, it's like uh, it's semi and in, in, semi independent. But it was a, it was a smaller publisher. I did an issue with them, mm-hmm. and a few pages. Um, that's like s- semi professional because I was uh, I was paid, but very little. <laughs> anyway, but is it local? Local by No, no, it's oh. international. Oh, international. I even had a J Lee cover, oh, so okay. so ah, yeah. Okay. Uh, but nothing came after that, and I just continued on college and and continue working. Mm-hmm. I and continue studying. So and then Wills came. And yeah, I dropped college for 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 reals. Wow! Yeah. So uh, <clears throat> how would you tell that story that uh, Will's? Uh, anong, what what what's it called? Uh, the school that he uh, um, set up, or just that it's different. Eh? There's the school um, in Learn. Learn, yun. There was the school and there was the studio. It's they're, they're, they're not exactly the same. I don't think he ever. I was, I'm thinking who he hired. That's a graduate of the school. Probably very few, I think. How how would you tell that story? How did mm. that begin? How? It was in parallel. So how did you get invited, Malgadon? <laughs> oh no, wait. Um, so um, there was a studio, and then he was he he formed a studio to do comic books for Wildstorm, mm-hmm. and then you know people showed him people submitted work, and he would choose among the submissions. The school is diff- is separate from it. Okay. I mean, of course, if if you find somebody good mm-hmm. in, in the school, then then he would hire. Him. But uh, it happened in parallel. It wasn't like okay, what, he set up parallel. A I mean, it happened in ah, the same okay. time. Sabi, sabi, yeah, so yeah. my studio dito, my school. Okay. Um, some of the people from the studio taught at the school. But yeah, it, it wasn't really you know oh, after school you you get hired. But mm-hmm. you naman know, hindi automatic. Uh, I may be mistaken. I think some colorists and some um, were, were alum or graduates of the school. Okay. Yeah. So how did you? Uh, <clears throat> how did the uh, Wills uh, parang assemble the mm. dream team of nineties ng comics? <laughs> hmm. Um. Uh, he had he had people working for him. I yeah. I think. Um. But he got Jerry and Roy Allen Martinez. 
as his first picks. And um, a few other guys like Gilbert um, and uh, the guys from Exodus Comics, uh, friends of Roy. Mm -hmm. And um, th there are a few, there are a couple more guys that um, their names escape me right now. But but yeah, Jerry and Roy were were the first team to to draw for Wills. They mm -hmm. did um, <clears throat> um, uh, Hazard for Wildstorm. Okay. So uh, we were like, you know, the cheering squad because we weren't doing any pro work yet. To? What, what, It was like 97. 97. 96. Sorry, 95, 96, 97. 95, 96. Ah, okay. I, mean, I think so, yeah. So uh, from what I, uh, from the things that I've read, parang mm -hmm. I think you guys had a uh, house. The, you rented the house and uh, parang, parang you were living together yeah. in, that, in that house. Yeah, it was, uh, Wills had... Um, Wills had a house in Pearl, and then when when he joined in, he left that that condo. It was a pretty big condo, and then he moved to Baleta Drive, which is a big house. Yeah. Um, where, um, yeah, we artists live. You know, we're we're free to to come and go, uh -huh. but uh, Jerry and Roy were there. We were there. It was a crazy house because while we were drawing. There was like a dance group be behind us practicing dance. Because <laughs> <laughs> it was like, because some of the people um, Wills hired were also managers of, of other entertainment. Um, ah, okay. And so I think it, that was also his intention, you know, be, may, being a, like, a, like a media, you know. Uh, okay. Um, a hub for yeah, artists a, a hub and for entertainers. Art, yeah, 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 yeah. Art and media and all that stuff. So I mean, you were you were probably the youngest back then. So, so uh, group, or one, at least maybe one of one of, one of the youngest. Yeah, oh, okay. I think I was the youngest, and then yeah. How was it? <laughs> yeah, it was. Um, how, how was it? How was it living with uh with uh these uh, artists? It was surreal because I, well, I I was um, so I quit college. I would, I quit college, and then because thinking I was gonna get some work immediately, mm -hmm. but. Uh, unfortunately, that was a time when comic books were, the bubble popped and there was not really any more, I mean, uh, f pro there were fewer projects than we expected. So, I ended up waiting for, for a year without doing anything. Uh, okay. So, and, as you mean yeah. when, but the bubble pop, uh, you mean, uh, you mean the... the projects dried up. Project, yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah. basically, from what, from what I know, parang... Uh, the market big long the crash for comics. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. That was the time. Yeah, yeah, and um, yeah. So like my parents were always, you know, the, the typical parents where they want they want their children to graduate and stuff mm -hmm. like that. But they were supporting me, and they're starting to get worried that you know, hey, um, we're you know we're think uh we're parang we're wondering if this is really the the right decision. You know, quitting college and then you know because this has been a year since and. So, and you know, just we were just playing play, uh, PlayStation games <laughs> at the studio, and you know. Uh, what did you tell them? Um, well, you know, I could always go back to college when it fails. Ah, well, and, I but I, I really, well, I kind of felt confident because um, aside from Wills, I also had some correspondence with people from Dark Horse Comics. Okay. So I, I kind of knew that you know I had potential, mm. um, but it was just, it just wasn't the, you know, the. The fast lane that I thought it would be, maybe. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so when did it, when did it start to uh, pick up? Oh uh, well, a year after, uh, a, few, a year after I joined, Will brought my stuff because again during that time I, I also wasn't ready yet. I was like a bad copy of Will's, and so mm -hmm. Will's uh, look at my stuff and hey maybe we should you should concentrate on figures first. You know, don't do shadings and stuff. So basically, I I experimented with my work. Mm -hmm. With this guidance and with the input of of, of of our studio mates, and then I came up with a portfolio. Um, um, actually, Wills was like, "Oh, let's let's make our own comics. Let's let's pitch it to to Wildstorm." Oh, okay. So we tried to do some some like six pages, and then he brought those six pages to San Diego Comic Con ninety eight ninety sorry ninety seven ninety six, mm -hmm. and then. Uh, unfortunately, people from Marvel liked it. Uh, my editors at Marvel liked it, and um, they gave me like a six-page um, test mm -hmm. page. 
that was like um a wolverine so that was those pages were already published i think but and i think i did, did a pretty good job for the samples because i had basically unlimited time for samples mm-hmm. right? so so there so yeah for uh, after a year i was without doing you know being an amateur artist with, with zero experience virtually i'm now doing the number four book of oh. <laughs> of all uh, you know of the whole industry from, from what i heard parang ano eh, uh, i think uh, i don't know if this is accurate pero mm. i heard uh wills gave a guarantee that uh, because the the editors were worried mm-hmm. that uh, you weren't you uh, the new guys yeah, since yeah. they didn't uh, meet them yeah, yeah. you guys uh parang maybe what if they don't finish yeah, yeah. Diba? so uh, what, from what i heard wills gave a guarantee that uh, if they don't finish, I will finish the project. But yeah, yeah, something yeah. like that. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> so yeah, we were his studio. Um, yeah. So before before this, pala, um, I did you know a few anti to wizard magazine. I did some fan art, but those weren't. Uh, it was a misconception. They thought I was I was hired because of those fan ah, art. It was oh, you know wow. I was just published by Wizard, but uh, as a fan, mm-hmm. as a fan art uh, artist, but had nothing to do with my professional mm-hmm. career. So, but I okay. mean, Wizard had everything to do with my professional career. They because of those fan art, and I became a pro. They supported my me, ah, so okay. they promoted me. So As- they, you know, so you know, Wizard was later on backing you up. Uh, yes, yeah. exactly. So, so parang, they were very, uh, very yeah. Parang they're kind of like parang oh, this is a Wizard kid. Yes, yes, exactly. <laughs> so yeah, so I I owe a lot to Wizard. But after the the fan art, you know, ah, yeah, during see. my Wolverine career, I see. So, <clears throat> well, speaking of Wolverine, uh, right now, I think, I think you have the best looking Wolverine in comics, in my no, personal thanks, opinion. Thanks. Uh, the, <laughs> the Wolverine and Luke Cage, oh, <laughs> you know, favorite you. na ano kaya? Ah, ito yung iba yung itsura ng Luke Cage, eh. thanks, I, thanks. I think that is the most badass Luke Cage and Wolverine. Uh, yun. Uh, so, so from there, <laughs> basically. <laughs> Uh, your career took off, and uh, uh, can you? Uh, I've heard some some rumors. Na, na, so, ang sinasabi sa parang you have this notoriety. Uh, mm-hmm. na, ano eh, na, you've never missed a deadline, though. Uh, <laughs> Is that true? Uh, <laughs> um, I, I I think I'm just dependable. Yeah, but missing deadlines, I miss deadlines a lot, but not to the extent that you know uh, editors would <laughs> oh, okay. would, yeah, would would freak out. I mean, you know, you miss a deadline, uh, but submit the last page the, the day after and all the stuff. Ah, Toler- tolerable, you know. But technically, I did miss deadlines, but I, I, I don't think I've ever put editors in trouble. I see. So yeah. So <laughs> how, how did you? How do you? Uh, how do you? Uh, uh, what do you call this? How did you develop that uh, that work ethic? Uh, why why are you that uh, what made you as dependable as you are I really don't know because I, I really think that that's the way people should be <laughs> so it was never a question to miss deadlines or to you know because uh, throughout my career I encountered other artists and I won't name names that you know they they hide from editors they don't answer emails yeah. they were given opportunities and they they screw it up and I, I, I it, it, my, it boggles my mind how you can do that so I just think I, I don't know where the work ethic comes from. It's just the way you should be, <laughs> I think. So, oh, yeah. you know, I maybe I have anxiety issues like, you know, oh, I need to finish this, I need to submit this now. I don't want to disappoint people and stuff like that, but I, I think it should be like automatic, you know, where you, you're given this opportunity and what, better. You know. What's your uh, work <laughs> routine? It changed. Uh, right now, I work at... Um, uh, I wake up at around 12 noon, maybe sometimes 2, depending on the the, 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 the night before. Um, um, I work very little or do social media stuff um, until, let's say, 5.30 and 6. And, I, and then I prepare. You wake up at around what? <laughs> around 12 um, noon or, 12 noon. Or, okay, okay. Or, or 2 in the afternoon. Okay. And then I do very light work, maybe some layouts and stuff. And then I leave for the gym. Usually, like three times a week, a, a week I, I leave for jujitsu around, let's say, six or six thirty. Mm-hmm. Um, and then I spend like you know, including dinners and stuff, mm-hmm. and and chatting with friends. And uh, I spend like five hours. Maybe I I will go home at eleven. Mm-hmm. 
wash my gi, feed the dog, and you know, start work at 12, basically. So 12 to 6. That's, that's usually how I work um, at night. Uh, so basically, you, you only work... Uh, so you do uh, the layouts first and then finish the layout um, 12 uh, midnight to I 6 mean, a.m.? Uh, it's not really... Um, Sometimes I just do. I spend like two days just doing layouts, ah, I and see. then the next few days, like let's say I'll I'll do layouts on six pages, mm-hmm. and then or four pages, sorry, and then the next few days I'll 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 start to flesh them out and then finish them. I'll, I'll do pages in batches. Mm. So yeah. So mm-hmm. uh, <laughs> I know <laughs> because uh, I'm sure a lot of people so. Uh, with, are curious because mm-hmm. uh, not a lot of people get the chance to work for 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 the top, the mm-hmm. top comics uh, um, publications, mm-hmm. right? Diba? So, uh, so uh, ano pa bang, uh, of all the of all the the uh, books that you've made, mm-hmm. which one do you, which which ones are your favorite? Uh, oh, this is a tough question. <laughs> I've, I've, I think I've. I've done like a hundred plus books. Oh, nga, eh, no? <clears throat> yeah, it's too how, many. Uh, yeah. And from uh, from uh, what year until for, for how many years now? I don't know. Like, ni- 1997 until 97. Now, yeah. So more than 20 years. I think so. Almost. Well, I, I, yeah, yeah. I never stopped working. Yeah. More than 20 years and mm-hmm. then a uh, hundred books. <laughs> I think that that means around know. five books uh, a year. I mean, that's, go, that's not uh, even that's not a lot actually. Really? Yeah, you're supposed to be doing. Eight to ten or something. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Five books is is, is not much. So, in fact, if you live mm-hmm. in the states, you can't sustain yourself in, in five. <laughs> really? With five books, yeah. I, I think so. Especially, I mean, it depends on the rates and mm-hmm. stuff like that. But that's not a lot. Five books. Five books. You mean five uh, issues? Issues. Right? Ah, that's, five that's issues. only. That's only. I'm. I'm not saying six issues. Yeah, five. So basically, yeah, eight to ten issues a year. Yeah. Ah. Okay. So that's like yeah, one trade paper back a year maybe. Mm. <laughs> so uh, which one is uh y- your no, your off your favorites top, off the top of my head? Oh, okay. uh, Art wise, mm-hmm. there's a lot. I like the Hickman Avengers. Uh, I I did two arcs. I like the the stuff I did with Mark Miller, um, the oh, Superior yeah. Super Crooks and um, and our um, uh, uh, Ultimate uh, Avengers run, uh, Ultimate. Wolverine vs. Hulk, mm-hmm. uh, my Bendis New Avengers, Birthright, Birthright, uh, yeah. Silent Dragon, and and High Roads. Those mm-hmm. are the uh, the creator own stuff I did with Andy Deagle and and Scott Lobdell. Um, <clears throat> so, uh, yeah, there, there was, there's there's a bunch that I like. Which one would you consider to be uh, the quintessential Liney Liu? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I really don't book. know. I really don't know. I think fans are the ones who. We should, you know. I think a lot of them like um, Secret Invasion, but oh yeah, for some reason I have um, um, some issues with it. But you know, <laughs> hey, why? Uh, what? I, <laughs> no. <laughs> I love the first issue, but I think some some of the pa- later issues were rushed a bit. And um, really, I think I mean, yeah. Oh, it's, it's my fault. And maybe um, we were we were also transitioning to from from. We were that was the first blue line inked issue. Blue line ma- means that I send them the file and then the inker would print out or mm-hmm. would be given a printout of the of the pencils, mm-hmm. a light blue printout. And sometimes the the printout is not clear, so the ink, you know, so the pencils aren't that clear, so the, the inking w- wouldn't be as faithful as I want it to be and stuff like oh, that. So, I see. Yeah, yeah. But you went crazy on that book, man. Uh, uh, it, yeah. was, uh, it was uh, it was was glorious. The spreads are just uh, basta. It could be better. It could be better. I think. Oh my yeah. god! I w- yeah. <laughs> but I was I was only drawing what I was told to draw. So <laughs> kudos to the to the writer. Yeah. Uh-huh. Well, speaking of uh, secret invasion, mm-hmm. um, uh, uh, with the uh, with the way the MCU is going, the right? yeah. uh, the scrolls had been. Uh, uh, introduced in uh, the MCU. Yeah. So this uh, na may secret invasion na ba? <laughs> um, I'm not sure because the the scrolls in the MCU is quite 
benign and oh, nga, eh, yeah. diba? so I think uh, Secret Invasion is dead <laughs> so, unless there's a there, there's a rebel faction maybe yeah, I'm sure you know uh, there, there's a Diba? Why, yeah, yeah. why did they do that? Diba? Para it's nice though. I enjoy, I enjoy the twist. I really enjoy the twist. <laughs> Spo- para, uh, sorry, spoilers, everyone. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Will there be spoilers throughout the, the podcast? That's... Uh, sorry na lang. Sorry <laughs> na lang sa mga ano. Ha. Pero uh, if we... Uh, pero we're planning kasi to, to do uh, an Avengers uh, mm-hmm. Endgame uh, Super podcast, eh. Okay. Maybe you'd like to join. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. We'll see. Mm-hmm. Okay, so, abangan nyo yun. Um, mm-hmm. uh, I'm, uh, we're building up uh, a panel. Teka, hindi ko malipat yung sarili ko. Uh, <laughs> we're building a panel for uh, an Avengers podcast. Avengers Endgame episode podcast. Ang gulo, no? So, uh, so you think, uh, have there been uh, any talks about... Uh, Secret Invasion, because I think that that is a a monumental event eh, in uh, in the Marvel universe. So, that mm. may Secret Invasion. Well, if there was, I wouldn't be privy to it. I'm just a comic book artist, guys. Sorry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> as much as I wanna, um, you know, uh, promote my my actual clout in the industry, I, I really don't. <laughs> I don't have any, so I wouldn't know. But I hope so. I hope so. Yeah. Okay, so mm-hmm. uh, so you have you haven't uh, heard any talks na, na it might uh, or you're not, you're just not telling us. Right uh, no, nah, I wouldn't. <laughs> okay. to, to be honest, my I think even the the Marvel comics um, the Marvel comics group is separate from Marvel Studio, so they wouldn't probably it, it, there, there's. And they they wouldn't tell me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> they want they, they they don't want any leaks. So. Ah yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh nga, no? They're always. Uh... It's very difficult to keep a lid on things. Yeah. Take a look. I'm using kulang tama na. Na wala yung pang ano ko. Siya. Oh. Wait lang, guys. Hi, pala kay ano Jason Paz and Steven Segovia. Oh nga. Listeners na then Knox. Oh, madam, madam, nang ano just uh, just. Uh... Shout out. Just uh, type in your questions, guys. Ma- uh, we're gonna look over the questions later on. Uh, teka, I ilang seconds pa yung delay nito? Mga, t- mga 20, thir- mga 30 seconds, mga ganun. Mm. <laughs> teka, ay- biglang nawala, biglang nasira yung remote control ko. <laughs> wait lang, ha? Okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait. I'll just use my mouse. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, guys. <laughs> oh, man. Wala. Yan na. Teka lang, ha? Wala, wala. <laughs> this should be, ano, eh. Uh, I'm just charging this. Uh, wait, wait. Okay, so uh, let's uh, may mga, let's uh, check the questions. Mm-hmm. So yun pala, mm. di ba parang uh, you talk about uh, super crooks, yeah. di ba? So yeah. there are uh, talk, it's already in production, di ba? Is it on production for a Netflix uh, uh, anime? I'm not sure if it's in production. Production, um, it's it's in the process of being produced, I think. Ah, okay. Because um, I'm, I think I'm gonna be contributing more designs and stuff, and I haven't done it yet. But yeah, I, I'm I'm gonna uh, yeah be designing some some characters, and uh, it, it's it's good of them to you know to to still ta- tap me because they didn't have to. Why? Yeah, but, uh, well, they 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 own the property now, and they can do with it whatever they want. But they want to be you know um lo- uh they want to be. Um, faithful to the source material, and therefore, just, therefore the the source creators. Mm-hmm. So Mark Miller will approve the the story. We'll do some notes, and I'll be providing some okay, know, character so design. But you're still co-creator, right? I'll always be the uh, I'll always be the co-creator because you know just because it's 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 a fact that I created it. But yeah, ownership wise, it's it's owned by Netflix or whatever. Um, yeah, oh, that's amazing because mm-hmm. uh, diba, uh, recently recent news then was uh, budgetans, uh, yeah, Trese yeah. and Kajo. I'm not sure diba? what what's the arrangement with budget. 
Yeah. No. Pero yung, how about in your in your case? Um, yeah, Netflix uh, has the rights right now. Ah, okay. Mm-hmm. Pero syempre, you, you, uh, uh, obviously you're gonna get credited as co-creator. Right? I, I hope so. <laughs> I, I hope so. <laughs> ah, ganun? No, no, no. I mean, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm sure. I'm sure we're gonna get credited. <laughs> <laughs> so, pagka, uh, pero well, ang nangyari dun, since uh, so basically hindi na sayo nakapag-usap hindi ka nakasama dun sa sa usapan nila nung uh, when they're finalizing the deal pa ganun um Netflix. it's a deal with Miller World so mm-hmm. it has to be i don't want to talk about the details but it was um it was um yeah i um kasama naman actually cuz we um um so Netflix bought Miller World but i had an option not to sell if i didn't want to oh really i mean you know i could because Mark Miller had like 20 properties and stuff like that so mm. they don't have to did they uh, acquire all of the Miller World uh, um, franchise the ones that weren't made into movies yet I think I mean depends on our, on, the, on who the creators were if 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 let's say I or Steve, Steve McNiven said yeah I don't I don't think I want to sell to Netflix then they, they wouldn't be able to, to get it why wouldn't they want to what if, you know? I what could, be you know, I could, <laughs> I could, you know, I could say, hey, maybe I could get a better deal in the future, or I could retain ownership. Ah, you know, okay, I see. Like okay. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a risk. It's a, you know. So when is it? Uh, when do you think would it uh, uh, show? I don't know, a couple of years, maybe. A couple of know. years. But it's it's a, uh, it's being produced by. Uh, Bones, uh, Japan. Uh, they're they're very. Is it the same with uh with uh Trece? I don't, I really don't know. I really don't ah, know. Okay. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, super cr- Netflix anime, yon, di ba? So mm. animation, nice. Yeah. Grabe. Uh, <laughs> how about Wave? Wave. <laughs> what is the story uh, about uh, about that character? So it was conceived by um, Greg Pak. Uh, as part of this Asian superhero team, mm-hmm. uh, he's he's very active in promoting Asians in comic books, and I really appreciate him for that. Mm-hmm. Um, um, so I came up with the visual. So it was just plain text that there's this female superhero, mm-hmm. Filipina, she's from Cebu and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. And but she did, she was water based, and then they approached me if I, I I was interested in designing it, and it was like oh, you're, you know. Uh, um, it's not gonna be. So, it's um. They were just asking if I if I want to do it, and I said, mm-hmm. "Hell yeah, I want to do it." Uh-huh. And um, I mean, what do you even have to ask? <laughs> so yeah, so I came up with a with a, with, with the visuals. The, what they handed me was like, um, basic. Uh, yung peg lang is a girl wearing um, what do you call that? The a dive uh, School. overalls overalls. Okay. Uh, what do you call that? Wetsuit. Though? A wetsuit, basically, mm-hmm. with, you know. So and then I, I went to town with it. Mm-hmm. I gave her the sword and the color combinations, um, the metallic parts because she's like technology based initially. But I'm not even sure. I'm not sure now if they developed it further. Okay. Um. So I gave her the lapu lapu sword. I was very conflicted while designing it because you know the first instinct when you're Filipino, you're creating a superhero. Oh shit. Mm-hmm. Filipino elements, flag, blah blah, oh. blah <laughs> buy, buy <laughs> in, you know, all the you know, tribal stuff, and mm-hmm. and so, but my approach is that I want her to become like a Spider Man instead of a uh, Captain Filipino, oh, yeah, Captain yeah. Pinas, Captain Pinay, or you oh, know. Eh. So I wanted her to be, a, you know, like not not a token Filipina. What team is she? Is she uh, um, Kasama? Uh, the Filipino Super Team Triumph. Triumph. Uh, tri- <laughs> I'm not following the comics, kasi, so uh, I, think, I have no idea. <laughs> uh, yeah. So right now she's gonna be appearing in uh, War of the Realms, Agents of Atlas, number one, and I think she's gonna be part of Aero. Aero is the is a super he- it's a Chinese superhero. Um, she's had, she has a solo book. She's, she's gonna be appearing along uh, alongside with Arrow, mm-hmm. which is, I think, part of her part of Ages of Atlas. Uh, that hero. Hopefully, um, Wave will have her own series, and I'm, I'm you know I would look forward to drawing it or just even the covers and stuff. Ah, that's great. 
Yeah. Uh, well, mm. uh, shout out then to powerful Nico Sawayan with his oh, uh, yeah. with his amazing wave cover. Yes. Na, which I think it's gonna be available in uh, Comic Odyssey soon. Uh, teka, pakita natin. Uh, where is it? Oh, wow. Hmm. Bakit? Wait, 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 wait. Wait. <laughs> there you go. Ayan. Ah, uh, hindi yan, bro. Mali, mali, hmm. mali. Ah, uh, dito pala. Ayan, ayan, ayan. So, free comic book day sa Comic Odyssey. Yeah. Uh, uh, to everyone who's, uh, this is Friday na, no? Ah, Saturday. Yeah, I think ah, so. Ah, Saturday. Ayan, May 4. Ano bang May 4, Pooch? <laughs> yeah, yeah, May 4. Trip. May 4. Free Comic Book Day. And also, if you share this, uh, this, uh, this podcast, screen cap, um, the, mm. the post, and then, uh, post it, um, in, uh, in the, may pinned post? May pinned post? Wala pala akong pinned post. Post it na lang in the TPKP page. And then I'm, ga- I'm gonna choose uh, a winner who will receive um, a trade paperback from Comic Odyssey. Ito, Free Comic Book Day. Um, it's uh, one of Lane Neal's books. Ito, yung ginawa ni Miko mm-hmm. na at na Wave. Mm-hmm. Na super, naging super viral. Yeah. Dahil kay, ano, dahil kay, uh, pakalitan? <laughs> <Nadine>. Kay Nadine. <laughs> <laughs> and, and that's why there's the she has, she's wearing a visor now. No, oh, ano? Biglang nagkaroon ng visor. <laughs> Ay ganon. Hindi na pa yeah. Parang sinigil be... sila. Ganon no, no, ba yon? No, 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 no. She's, they're just being careful. They're just being careful. I see. Yeah. Ay, it's sold out. Yun nga lang. Yeah. Um, I think uh, it's sold out. Pero those who were able to order, um, you can. Uh, well, basahin yun na lang. Mm-hmm. Di ko alam. Um, di ko siya na check pero definitely May May 4 is a free comic book day um, sa Comic Odyssey in Bonifacio High Street dun sa fully booked ang oh, weird no fully booked tapos may comic Odyssey <laughs> yeah, I mean sana na ako matagal na lang oh, eh, pero you're you're not you're gonna be in, a, in I'm gonna, another I'm gonna be at Phil Bars uh, because I, I, I Usually I'm I'm with Comic Odyssey during mm-hmm. FCBD, mm-hmm. but for this year, para may iba lang, may iba and, lang. and uh, we're all friends in the industry. Yes, of course. So I'm I'm doing one with Phil Bars, Phil Bars uh, Podium. I podium. Think. podium. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so yes. sa Podium si Linil. Mm-hmm. Um, tapos uh, yun, free comic book day. What's what's free comic book day for those who's uh, um, not so familiar? It, um, it's an initiative by the whole industry to uh, encourage. Um, outsiders, I mean non-comic book readers, to mm-hmm. you know to try comic books. So the the comic book shops will be giving away um, free comics for uh, for for basically everyone who lines up, mm-hmm. and the whole um, there will also be exclusive comic books for just for this for that event. They will be giving away. So there are comics that are published just for that event itself. Aside oh. from aside from back issues that are being given away. Yeah. Well, also the the local artists are stepping up. There are lots of uh, local creators. Mm-hmm. Na iba, uh, I would assume some of some of them uh, ha- are not really making mo- a lot of money with their works, but they participate yeah, in, yeah. in uh, FCBD, mm-hmm. diba? which is so kudos to you to you guys. Um, uh, yun. So if you're not uh, into not familiar with the comics uh, world, especially the local scene, mm-hmm. check out. Uh, um, free comic book day in uh, to all participate participating stores. Check mm, yeah. check nyo na lang. I think uh, may Facebook page. So definitely fully booked. Phil bars and Comic Odyssey are participating. So uh, pila, makipila lang kayo. So you're gonna get a free comic book and some discounts yata for that day. May mga exclusive discounts sila. So yun, balik tayo kay, ano, <laughs> kay Wave. Mm-hmm. <laughs> ano ba? Diba? So, uh, uh, ano yung powers niya? Hindi, ano na ba siya? Parang, parang meta-human ba siya? Or is, it, uh, is she dependent on the suit lang talaga? So initially, I thought she's dependent on the suit, but I've... I'm not even sure if I can say. Oh, okay. Um, she seems to have some other interesting powers, but I'd rather that you guys, you know, read the actual Just comic read. books. Just read it. It's, I think it's very, it's a huge potential, and I really think that decision. 
the, my decision of not turning her into just you know like a Filipina um, flag bearer mm-hmm. is is a good one. So she can blend in with any superhero group. She she should be. Like, I really want her to be a Spider Man or Spider Woman. Then mm-hmm. you know. What what kind, what were your uh, inspirations? Pinoy. What what are the Pinoy I, Pinoy elements that. I I used I gave her like a, a lapu lapu sword, mm-hmm. uh, the kampilan, oh. but it's like a high tech version. Uh-huh. Um, oh, I I had I made a mistake of you know giving her too too much uh, um, European features, uh, but that was you know that was just one drawing and you know it's not even y- y- different artists can can cast different act, you know different models for for their heroes and stuff mm-hmm. like that so it doesn't really you know. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, were there other um, um, other artists na from other Asian countries who who were tapped to uh, design uh, for for heroes from uh, other? I think Asian so. Yeah, countries? Marvel is getting more international, and actually, the the artist for War of the Realms, um, Agents of Atlas, is very good. He's, he's Korean. I've seen the interior art, and he drew wave pretty well. And I, I look forward to it. I think it's it's a, gonna be a good issue. The one is uh, the one Miko did okay. a cover for. Yeah, I don't know. I don't even know which cover they're using mine. I don't think they're using my cover. <laughs> but oh, yeah, that yeah. it's a Korean artist. It's really good. Agents of Atlas. What's the name? Is the name there on the credits? Um, no, no name, right? It's a, a little medjo. Um, so Wave will be appearing well, yeah. there, yeah, and it's it's a it's a nice issue. <laughs> Parang yung nakita ko may mga ano eh, may mga pins pins pa siya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just ah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I gave. <laughs> she's um uh, it's not a wing, it's more like a fin, like a mm. like a single f- uh single file fin cuz she's water based and she's, she's supposed to Well, a lot of uh, a lot of people are <clears throat> excited <laughs> yeah. and also thrilled <laughs> na merong ganyan. Uh Ano pa ba? Oh, gusto niya bang mag-Avengers kami? <laughs> <laughs> spoilers. <laughs> okay, spoilers, diba? <laughs> so, uh, do you think these uh, new characters would be would be able to make it in the MCU? Kasi, uh, for, by the looks of it, parang yun, yun yung nagiging trend sa, ano, eh, sa Marvel, eh, yung, ah, or sa Disney. Yeah, yeah. Yung parang, uh, um, uh, what, what's the term? Um... Diversity sa mga characters, di ba? <laughs> anything, anything can happen. And for sure, because I, I just came back from China mm-hmm. uh, with Marvel and Wacom were promoting both Marvel Comics and Wacom, the the equipment, the drawing. Yeah, yeah. And they're, they really want to um, penetrate uh, the China market. Mm-hmm. And so... Um, diversity is e- diversity is really something they they're going for, and it's you know it's it's a global market, mm-hmm. and I really won't be surprised if if you know Wave will be in in the MCU. Who knows, you know? No, but know. to be honest, I really don't know what's going on. So I mean, oh. I wouldn't be you know. I think I saw uh, a, a video in uh, YouTube of mga nakalined up na movies for. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, after Endgame, mm-hmm. one is uh, a Chinese, parang Bruce Lee ang dating. Oh yeah, Shang Chi. Shang ano? Shang Chi. Oh, parang ganon. Yeah, he, 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 <laughs> Shang Li. <laughs> he's an established uh, Marvel. I'm not hero. familiar with that hero. Yeah, he's basically um, uh, pegged um, on Bruce Lee. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. so yeah. So and it, huge talaga yung Chinese market kasi talaga. Eh, yeah, but uh, Shang Chi has been around for a while now. Yeah, in, in comics. So. Mm-hmm. So uh, from uh, from what I heard, th- there was a talk in uh, in uh, gaming naman to sa games, because mm-hmm. uh, parang I, th- I forget that convention. Eh. Pero mm-hmm. somebody from the gaming industry was talking. Um, there are basically four markets mm-hmm. in uh, in the world for gaming. Uh, one is uh, uh, the U.S. North America, mm-hmm. tapos Europe. Uh, y- yun yung mga billion dollars na ano ah, yun yung mga billion dollar markets. Yeah. Uh, US, China, China alone is a uh, four billion dollar ano eh. yeah, China but... and Southeast Asia yata eh. Ano China, Southeast Asia, mm-hmm. US and the uh, 
pero Japan, <laughs> Japan alone by by its own lang. Japan is a 4 billion market. I, I don't know. Talaga Japan. Oh, ganun, <laughs> ganun katinding mag-consume ng ano ng uh, ng uh, content ng probably, games ng uh, ano Japan. Probably Korea is um, the majority sa ano sa Southeast Asia. Korea siguro. Korea yeah, o oh, yeah, sa Southeast yeah. Asia yeah. no. Tapos China. Mm. Ikaw, China has, I think China has their own market. Is their mm. own market. But lagi apat na yun ano. <laughs> Maybe it's a lima. But mm. definitely, oh, I think US, well, US naman kasi is malaki, di ba? Yeah. Malaki yeah. naman nun. O, tapos Europe, maybe US, Europe, uh, Southeast Asia, China, mm-hmm. and then Japan. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yan yung mga billion dollar yeah. markets uh, ano, sa, sa gaming industry. Mm-hmm. Sa, eh, sa ano naman pati, sa Japan, uh, yung mga mobile gaming, lahat naman ng ano, di ba? Mm-hmm. Maklase. Mm-hmm. So, uh, ito, um, how about, uh, di ba, so you have, uh, you've, uh, tanong ko lang, uh, you've been working for more than 20 years in, uh, in, uh, Tagon, on international comics in Marvel, and, uh, no. how about, do you have any plans of coming up with your own <laughs> comics here, di ba, <laughs> mm. or at least kahit international din, di ba, or you talagang, ano, uh, uh, uh Creator owned by Lyle. Uh, <laughs> I I always have always have plans, but I I don't think I'll ever be. I'll have the the balls to to go through with it. You know, really? it's, it's really it's, it's scary. You know, I don't know. Well, probably in the future, but it's it's something that scares me because you know I don't want to you know to fail and you know for mm-hmm. it to not be um, supported by people or not be liked by it's, it's gonna be a bit personal I see so yeah but you know everyone every single artist has their own uh, uh, creations and yeah. ideas and stuff like that but also at the same time <laughs> the stuff that I like is also um, you know uh, it's similar to, to what's already out there so it may not be ah, okay. as original as I I, I Want it to be, but at the same time, it's really the execution. I mean, mm-hmm. if you think about it, um, it's really how you 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 tell the story because really the the ideas are you know it's paulit ulit na rin lang yeah like science rin. fiction everything has been covered by Rick and Morty and, <laughs> <laughs> and Black Mirror basically so well it's a bad guy, no? yeah, yeah so you know so if you're gonna, uh, so that's the kind of stories that uh, you that you think you'd uh, yeah, you would, you would do para ganun. or sci- more sci-fi, uh, not so much superheroes, but yeah. But I think the market, the the fan base that I have, are more into superheroes. So ah, I'm not yeah. sure if it's gonna work. But I'm I'm really um, at heart, I'm really an illustrator. Mm. I think, and I just enjoy drawing images, and it seems um, satisfying to me just to you know produce the, not really to tell different stories, but like I really enjoy the act of drawing itself. So ah. it's kind of a, it's mababo, but. You know, it, mm. I'm 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 happy enough just drew, just drawing actually, and it's probably a bad thing. I don't know, <laughs> but yeah. What what, what mm. keeps you uh, drawing? Na hindi ka parang nagsasawa, parang ano? Um, um, I think it's really the yeah the fans and mm-hmm. it's it's a cliche, but you know, just being you know um, st- still trying to to slowly improve myself mm-hmm. because. I, you know, I think this it's. I think I still have so so many holes in my in my skill set, and I could be still be better. And you know, being relevant, and I mm-hmm. I I don't think I'll ever retire completely, even if I don't need to draw for work for money and stuff mm-hmm. like that. I'd still wanna do covers, and you know. Mm-hmm. So I think it's more being relevant, I guess. <laughs> maybe. What What would you? say to uh, those uh, artists mm. who are struggling na parang kasi mm. for a lot for a lot of them including myself mm. parang Lionel Liu is uh, at the pinnacle of uh, <laughs> the the things that uh, that you want to achieve as an mm. artist especially mm. in the comics field diba mm. so and that uh, and now uh, I'm hearing you. Parang you're, you're still constantly trying to improve, the So yeah, what, what, what kind th- of those are different things. Mm-hmm. I think uh, career-wise, I've I've pretty much made it mm-hmm. because you know Marvel is treating me well. I'm I'm doing the top books. I did you know so it's uh, but it's different you know being be drawing the the highest profile books in Marvel mm-hmm. uh, is different from being the best in your craft. 
So I still I'm not you know <laughs> you know like you get what I'm saying. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. The best artist doesn't is not necessarily the most popular sometimes, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, like, um you know, some some people are making fun of let's say Rob Liefeld. Yeah. But he's definitely the biggest one of the biggest artists ever. Mm-hmm. And he's a mega star. I see. And uh, but you know, a lot of people will say, oh, "Of course, he's not really. You know, he's not. Uh, technically, he's not really the best artist. Mm-hmm. But there's something about his work that or clicks." Or Todd McFarlane, the best. Oh yeah, yeah, whoever. Like God even Jim Lee, even mm-hmm. Wills, and especially me. Mm-hmm. Like um, I'm, I, <laughs> I'm not. You know, I'm not Alex Ross. Uh-huh. Uh, just, just you know. Uh, so there's a lot of room to grow uh, for growth. So which, uh, sino yung mga parang ano mo? Parang pinakang idol na. Parang, ah, ito yung, ano, parang gold standard for you. <laughs> standard. It's different eh, because uh, I think one of the best artists ever is Alex Ross. Mm-hmm. But he's not really my my peg. He's not the person I'm, I want to be. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, nga eh. Diba? Kasi iba yung style mo yeah, eh. Diba? Yeah, style mo. Naman, eh. But definitely, if, like, like I cringe when people say, oh, you're a master and you're, stuff, mm-hmm. uh, you're great. And then I think, oh, so what? Or you're, you know, some guys, some guys exaggerate. Oh, you're a god and stuff uh, like that. So I'm like, the back of my head... And like, then what do you call Alex, Alex Ross? You know, <laughs> people like him, like right. So there's like a huge gap between me and Alex Ross, and and other and there there are a lot lots of artists in between. Mm-hmm. So um, what was I? And then there's there are guys like you know Kim Jung Ji who's like oh, crazy, and uh, doing stuff that I could never you know imagine possible. <laughs> Well, so, yeah. I'm sure you can do the drawings, but the way he does it, yes, na walang, yes, yes. Na, ano yeah, yeah, yeah. Na walang, uh, on, walang pencil, di ba? On, on, a, on, on a huge wall oh. every day while talking to people. <laughs> I, I missed uh, Kim Jong Gi in Manila, sayang. Sobrang mm. nang hinaya ako nun. Di ko alam. Yeah, it's like, yeah. So, artists like that make mm. me, you know, realize like, oh, shit. Uh, but, but then again, there are people who are, <laughs> let's say, uh, 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 <clears throat> Who's the who's the creator of uh, Peanuts? Snoopy. Mm-hmm. Diba, parang, if you if you're going to compare mm-hmm. their art style to mm-hmm. yours, di ba? Alayo nung ano nung nung uh, nung detail nung sayo. Pero at the same time, they're legends on their. Siempre de ba? Yeah, legends. Yeah. So, uh, Charles Schultz ba? Schultz yeah, ba? Charles Schultz. That's different, eh? but that that's the that's the style that they pursued. What if they pursued my style? They could probably. It, pro- it could probably be better, di ba? Parang that w- that's the well, that's yeah, the no? language that they try to speak. Mm-hmm. You know? So, so well, parang sinabing, let's say, parang rock guitarist, oh, mas hindi naman siya yung sa orchestra, di ba? But uh-oh. they're probably the same skill level or talent, but one pursued something else. Like a different mm-hmm. kind of music, different kind of art. Parang you can't, uh, you can't uh, <laughs> parang discriminate na parang just because let's say pop mm. uh, yeah. tapos uh, let's say prog yung ano yung mm. uh, isang uh, banda say wow, walang sinabi yung pop may, pero kung si Michael Jackson naman yung pop up diba? Yeah, yeah, diba? Yeah. so parang ibang level din yun yeah. so this, I think it's the same way with art diba parang mm-hmm. uh, if, uh, parang like let's say si Manic Sabrera yung mm-hmm. style niya diba they he created a market for for his art mm-hmm. tapos yung mga ano niya parang mga silhouette lang diba parang yeah. mga mumu diba mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah so uh pero arguably uh, he's a, well definitely he's one of the most popular comics uh, artist in the yeah, Philippines for sure uh, for sure yun so so yeah so to answer your questions my the, the artists that i currently like of course i mean when I started out, it's always you know Wills mm-hmm. and Travis, uh, Charé, Charis. Ch- uh, uh, Charé, Char- Char- <laughs> I think uh, French Canadian. So Char- ah, Charé, I'm not sure. No way. The image, all the image founders, mm-hmm. almost all of them. <laughs> and um, almost. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Adam okay, Hughes. Okay. For the record, I like Rob Liefeld. Oh, For okay, the record, okay. yeah. um, you know, Adam Hughes, Mike Mignola, mm-hmm. the the newer ones, quote unquote newer ones. Um, uh, well, he's like my contemporary, um, Olivier Coppel. Um, I, you know, I really like his work. Um, and uh, Luis La Rosa. Yeah. Mm. And of course, our 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 local artists are awesome as well. Yeah. Yes, for sure. Grabe. So before, uh, it used to be that, uh, parang, 
uh, there's uh, only a handful of you guys. Parang you, Carlo, Pagudayan, and then Jerry, and then uh, yeah, Steven, who else? Jay Anacleto. Jay Anacleto. Uh, uh, Harvey. Actually, parang second wave na nga yung ano eh, si Stephen eh. Parang I would consider them mm-hmm. as, uh, kasi mga, mga mid-2000s na sila eh. Miko. I'm not, si Miko. I'm not sure kung sino nauna, Miko or Stephen? I, I think around the same time. Around ah, the same time. 2006 yeah. yeah. And the, si, Ro, at least si Roy yung nauna talaga, si Roy Alan uh-huh. Martinez. And then there was this Johnny Rasso, I think. I forget, but he disappeared. Sino? Jo- Johnny Rasso, I forget mm-hmm. for his name. And then uh, there was, like, yung Saster, there was this guy, um, Oliver Isabedra, who did, who was, you know, who did Aster? So he was like one of the first Filipino mm-hmm. artists after Wills who broke in broke in the professional scene, but he, he also disappeared. I don't know. I don't. Yeah. So of course you know Wilson Wilson mm-hmm. oh, yeah. this, this is why I don't mention Filipino names because I okay. might forget someone and then patay na. So. Okay, lang yun. <laughs> Wag na kayo magtampo, please okay, lang. <laughs> Uh, I'm sure that. Uh, si Kim Masinto, mm. Dexter Soy. Uh, uh, spe- speaking of ado, ano, ah, sige, sige. Uh, th- uh, you have been. Um, ah, si oh. Jason Pass, magtatampo. Hindi <laughs> ko binamagat mga inker. Oh, si man. Jerry, no? Si Jason, si. Si. Uh, si Ed. Si Ed. Si Ed. Ed. Tapos sa colorist, si Rain, si Romulo. Mm. Si Kasama niyo pa dati si Arnold Ares sa Michael Bartolo, si sino pa ba? Si si mulong favorite ko na local colorist. Pero usually si si Sunny Go yung ano, uh, colorist ko. He's mm, from no. Indonesia. Yeah. Yeah, uh, I was uh, asking yung um si uh, you've been uh, for a lot of your books, hmm. you've been partnering with uh, yung legendary t- team up nyo ni Jerry Lagila, yeah, yeah, di ba? Yeah, so, yeah. can you uh, ano, bakit bakit uh, ganun ng ano, bakit si Jerry lagi yung what, what's the story behind that? Oh, he's, you know, he's um he's the uh, force, he's the best. Nah, uh. <laughs> yeah, um, he's Willis' uh, first pick and um Aside from, he also, basically, he's the one who, who pushed Wills to try me as an artist. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, he's really good with a, with, a, with a pen and ink. So mm-hmm. he's definitely very meticulous with his work. And, and yeah. Do you demand uh, to, uh, no, to, uh, to have him uh, as your partner? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, talaga. Yeah. yeah. On covers, I do, my, do it myself because it's, first of all, it's fun to also ink. Mm-hmm. And um, <clears throat> I like the roughness and you know being getting my hands dirty from time to time. <laughs> mm-hmm. And yeah. Um, so uh, <clears throat> what's what? What? Ani yung ani mga nagustuhan mo? That's <laughs> pa ni yung uh, dynamics nyo with uh with, with your team up. Parang oh, because right now we've been working together for more than a decade now. So no, he would know. My intentions, Nali. Even if my lines are a bit rougher, he would know what, mm. what to do with it. And um, <clears throat> um, yeah, I mean, you're more comfortable. You can work faster. Mm. And um, he, he takes care of my faces because I really cringe when I when I don't recognize my face. Like when you draw something and somebody else is somebody else inks it mm-hmm. and it looks different. You know, it's ah, not okay. it's not the way you draw your face. That's why. You know, it, it, it kind of bothers me. So, some issues before, like older issues where I w- didn't have complete control of the inks. Mm-hmm. Um, I would, you know, uh, flinch or, or yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, see, ah, this is not the face I drew. Oh, my yeah. God. So, yeah. so like, how, how often does that happen? Or at least, it ha- did, uh, did that happen It happened a lot before. But right now, because of, uh, because of Photoshop and stuff like that. So, mm-hmm. what, what happens is that when Jerry hands me the ink stuff and I would review it. Mm-hmm. And, you know, make some very, very small corrections from time to time. Very oh, rare. That I need to, especially the small drawings when, when you know, you have to zoom in. Mm-hmm. So the, the, he can only, you know, the eye can only see uh, uh, so much. So, so I need to make some slight, you know, uh, correction on, mm. on tiny faces. But since it's your mm. drawing, parang you need to, ano, parang alam mo kung ano yeah, sa sh- yeah, 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 I should know, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Where to look. Yes, yes. <clears throat> uh, so, <clears throat> how about, the, how, have there been uh, projects na parang hindi ka na-satisfy uh, with the result, yung, uh, yung yeah, final? There's, the, yeah, there's a bunch like, 
coloring that I wasn't happy with, um, inks that I wasn't happy with. I, How do you handle those uh, situations? I, I never look at them again. <laughs> uh, that, that's how I handle it. I, I don't. I don't browse it. I don't. Do you complain with uh, with the editors or? <laughs> nah, it's too late when you complain. Eh? So, I would violently disagree if they want the they want no 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 not violently dis- disagree. I would probably just um, um, protest if they're gonna pair me up with the same uh, ah, colors see. again. Because I I I, was, I I just I'm just gonna say that we're no we're not a good fit. Mm. Yeah, maybe I should try somebody else and stuff like that. I see. But you really can't. You have to be respectful too. And you have to be, you know, political and stuff like that. You, yeah. have, you can't, you know, say, "Oh, he sucks." Mm. But yeah, you have to be respectful. Of course, just, just not work with them siguro, again. That doesn't mean that they suck. It's just uh, not a good fit with uh, with your style, siguro. Yeah, so. yeah. Or maybe they suck. But, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. but yeah, yeah. That's true. That's true. That's yeah, always it, a possibility. A, no, no. I mean, <laughs> uh, very rarely. Uh, a lot of them are just are good are good at what they do, but it's just just not a, a good fit mm-hmm. at that time. Or there are some circumstances where you know at, they didn't have enough time mm-hmm. and stuff like that. At at this point, mm-hmm. uh, um, does uh, let's say a colorist uh, the uh, do uh, color colorists need to gather <clears throat> enough street cred to work with you? And uh, I say you're one of the in the top tiers, say, eh? Not really, sc- not really street cred. I just it, it's that's why in art it's so easy to get in because you know you can in five seconds you can tell oh this is a good artist this is a good colorist he has good taste mm-hmm. and then you you test them you give them a project if they submit or in time are, are they able to do it well um, under pressure and then mm-hmm. yeah that's that's the sc- that's the only street street cred you need. Uh, having good portfolio and submitting on time, you don't need to. You know, you don't need um, like a huge uh, portfolio. Actually. All right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Even, a new colorist right. could pop up and say, "Hey, this is my work. I've never done any comics before. Mm-hmm. Let me try out." And then, if they're if they submit on time, if they produce good work, then they're in. How? how <clears throat> what is the process uh, nowadays on uh, on getting into Marvel <clears throat> and uh, DC and um, I think I would think right now it's easier than back. before oh. because Marvel is actively looking for new talent all over the world and you can have everyone has Facebook pages or Instagram pages or mm-hmm. you know um, everyone is so visible that it's yeah. easy it's really easy to be to be seen mm-hmm. and but at the same time it's also you know the competition is tougher because you're, you're competing with every single person in the oh, world I know. yeah Sometimes, kasi parang, uh, if uh, there was social media back then, I- mm-hmm. I'm sure a lot of madaming uh, magaling din na w- ju- just wasn't uh, just didn't have the means to to have access with yeah. the editors <laughs> or meet somebody like Wills, de ba? Parang, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Diba? parang you'll never know who who missed the train, eh, no? Yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> um. There, there, there are channels, naman. There are channels uh, like um, even before in comic books, there mm-hmm. are some submission edi- editors yeah. like that. So people would eventually find it, but it's just a bit harder. You know, snail mail, FedEx, the your portfolio and stuff like that. It's harder. But even until now, people are still go personally to to con- conventions and mm-hmm. show their works to editors in person. Well, I yeah. suppose uh, it goes to show you those who got in, like you guys, because mm-hmm. you're the one, you are the ones who were submitting to Wizard, right? Yeah, yeah, so yeah. you are probably the ones who who wanted the most. Yeah, that's yeah, why yeah, you got yeah. it. Right? Yeah. So sometimes that's all you need. Eh? You need, you just need to want to want yeah. it that much. Yes, yes. And then of course, uh, hone the talent. Yeah. Right? Ano yung tatanungin ko? <laughs> <laughs> so, so ngayon, ah, teka, let's see if there's ano. Uh, Am I being too serious? No, no. Siya ata lahat ang sagot. <laughs> okay lang, okay lang. Pwede, pwede ka rin mag-ano. <laughs> <laughs> Hindi ka umiinom, no? <laughs> uh, unfortunately, no, I'm... <laughs> just coffee, just coffee. Is it, uh, is it, uh, uh, let's talk about jiu-jitsu naman. Jiu-jitsu. Sure, sure. So, uh, how, how long have you been training? 
Kasi I'm a, I'm a huge MMA fan. Mm, I, I've, I, I, I've I attended know. a few seminars of uh-huh. jiu-jitsu. Uh-huh. Pero I, I wouldn't say I know jiu-jitsu. Uh-huh. Uh, pero, pero I am a huge fan of the, of the art yeah. and uh, how, I mean, how, <clears throat> how uh, intricate mm-hmm. and uh, parang chess eh, and yeah, how yeah. the people uh, in the jiu-jitsu world um, talk about it mm-hmm. it's very fascinating to me yeah, yeah. so what do you what's uh, what are your thoughts about so it? i trained i trained for two years about 10 years oh, sorry 15 years ago around 2004 to 2006 i trained on and off for two years mm-hmm. but very casual training very light training like twice a week Mm-hmm. It's, a, it's a lot for me now. And then in 2015, I came back. I trained um, more frequently, like let's say three times a week, which is still a hobbyist uh, frequency. Mm-hmm. I trained with my old um, teammate, and now my coach, uh, Mark Entrata. He's Team Valores. And um, we're now carrying the uh, uh, Cobrinha affiliation in the Philippines. The what? Uh, Cobrinha. Ah, Cobrinha. It's a, right. He's a multiple-time world champion, and we're rep- representing his team here. Mm-hmm. Uh, there are lots of, of, of uh, good jiu-jitsu teams in the Philippines, and we're, we're one of the smaller ones, but we're, we're, we're growing. Mm-hmm. And so, yeah, I've been training regularly since 2015 until now, but at a um, hobbyist level, so it's more like uh, the three, three times a week. Okay. Um, yeah. So, uh, <clears throat> pag... Uh, Anong, anong belt mo ngayon? <laughs> well, purple belt. Purple, purple belt ka yeah, na? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, wow. So, so you start at white belt white and then... Belt. And there are four stripes at white belt. Uh, one, two, three, four. Mm-hmm. And then blue belt. Blue and belt. one, two, three, four. And then purple belt. Purple. Shit. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but, you know, I, I'm not a competitor. So, it's... It, 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 it's a competitor level. But, yeah. And I'm competent enough. You are lethal, man. Yeah. <laughs> once, you, once you reach purple, it's a... It's a, it's a it, whole it's new a, level. Yeah, it's a, seri- it's a more seri- started, yeah, it's a more serious belt. Yeah. Um, yeah it, t- it takes a long time, I think. Diba, parang... Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of uh, people na parang, um, <clears throat> who don't understand <clears throat> jiu-jitsu. But, mm-hmm. but for me, it's a... Um, uh, from the things that I uh, that I uh, read and watched mm-hmm. on YouTube and the uh, mga sinabi ng mga coach na attendant yeah. ko, parang it's a uh, jujitsu is not just a, a physical training; it's mm-hmm. also a, a mindset that uh, that gets uh, inculcated in uh, in the yung student, mm-hmm. di ba? So. Uh, Ano yung mga, would you yeah. how uh, would you recommend what are the things so well, <laughs> um, uh, um okay so uh, jiu jitsu for me is um i look at it as more like a um, like a sport like boxing or mm-hmm. wrestling um and um i think that really changed my life uh, tremendously because be- as an artist diba, mm-hmm. we, we just sit down and stuff like that and mm-hmm. at 34 years old before feeling ko ang tanda ko na parang hirap na magbuhat stuff and then now at 40 I'm, go- I'm turning 42 mm-hmm. I'm, I'm I think I'm fitter than 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 when I was uh, 10 years ago mm-hmm. um, Jiu Jitsu is parang um, it, I'm not gonna imbue on it like parang spirituality stuff uh-huh. like that stuff like that I'm, I'm more like ano pa rin siya, like for me like um, whatever um, you know wrestling and boxing but mm-hmm. this martial art not even martial art because martial arts when you say martial art meron siyang you know may discipline stuff that, mm-hmm. like, you know, may, may, may ganong dating eh. okay. for me lang personal lang mm-hmm. um, I just think it's more like a very good sport with um, um, and uh, so I'm, I, I might I might be screwing this up. Ano ba? Uh, okay lang, okay lang. <laughs> okay lang. Um, it's it's very social. It's mm-hmm. also quite intimate. So so you're basically trusting someone, your training partner, not to hurt you mm-hmm. when you train every day. And the reason it works is because every single night you spar and you test what you learn every night, mm-hmm. and that's why it works. And the same way boxing, how boxing works and wrestling works and judo works mm-hmm. and the stuff that you know works in the UFC mm-hmm. because you test it every time, but you just is safer than boxing because you don't get knocked out. Oh my! And no. you go, you go one hundred percent, and you're not injured most of the time. Um, but in boxing, one hundred percent. 
tulog yung kalaban oh. mo. So, <laughs> unless yeah, yeah. unless you yeah. uh, parang gagagawin ka talaga, yeah, yeah, diba? Yeah. So, yeah, it's it's um, man, I I you know, I really recommend everyone try it. And I you know, if if I had like children, I would mm-hmm. definitely enroll all of them oh, in it. So, diba? it's really um not not just for self defense, mm-hmm. it's for for yeah, character for, building. No? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, diba? it it tests you all the time. And also for me like it like right now sa so before kasi parang I realized parang mas mainit ulo ko para kasi parang insecurity pala yon feeling ko parang mm. gago to ah, parang mm-hmm. you have to you have to tense up you have to be ready for anything baka may mangyari ganun ganun anong mangyayari so parang then but when when you train and you know what what happens um you you, you tend to be calmer feeling ko lang you mm-hmm. tend to be calmer and what they say is parang uh, you get humbled over and over again yeah yeah so, so such that yung yabang mo shit wala pa yeah diba? actually, yeah like <laughs> it's uh it's anyway but like uh, when uh, uh even in the when you're boxing mm. uh, first time you spar yeah. uh, first time you go to the gym mm. uh syempre hindi ka pa marunong you don't mm. know how to punch it and then mm. you learn a little bit yeah. and then you think you're you know it already and then you yeah. get inside the ring and uh, spar with your coach and then <laughs> you, sure. get, uh, you get you uh, get you get your ass whoop yeah, yeah, yeah and then uh parang all of a, all of a sudden you you go back to zero again yeah. and then it's a it's a different thing kasi when you're sparring with a, yeah. a, another person eh. i think jiu jitsu is the only sport that um really allows a smaller person to beat a bigger stronger person yeah and i really think i'm really confident that even girls can can really like you know, weaker girls that are outweighed by mm-hmm. few uh, by by a, by a lot, uh, by significantly you know um, heavier person. Mm-hmm. They they really can. Like right now, we have we have some girls who, are, who can who give me a hard time, and I outweigh them. <laughs> so I think that it's yeah. Um, I really recommend it. And my coach right now, some of, some of my coaches. Cause I have several coaches aside from aside from Coach Mark. Um, like some of them, I outweigh by fifty pounds, and at you know at purple belt, they still beat me, mm-hmm. um, c- control me, and stuff like that. It's really wow. amazing. Uh, it's like a superpower, really, because oh, <laughs> it's really amazing. Like, you know, it's it's um, yep. Uh, you sh- you guys should try it. <laughs> Just a few weeks ago, uh, I was uh, um, I r- I rolled with uh, one with uh, one of the. I think he's a uh, brown belt. Na sh- uh, no, no, no. Mm-hmm. I, may, I may not. Baka mali ako. Mm-hmm. Pero basta, he's a uh, mataas na yung belt niya. Mm-hmm. Uh, and uh, what I said is, parang, uh, try to, kumbaga, try to attack me. Let's mm-hmm. see if, uh, if uh, what, 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 uh, can a guy like me do mm-hmm. with, with uh, very minimal knowledge about mm-hmm. the art. Mm-hmm. Uh, I didn't last na eh. so yeah. 20 seconds uh, yeah. I'm tapping diba yeah, yeah. especially at saka yung mga he, got, he he caught me with uh, arm bars na alam mo yun mm. hindi, hindi ko nakikita sa UFC eh, yeah, diba? yeah. so it's really parang it's accurate eh. it's a super power it really is na, it really is diba kasi especially uh pag uh, sa ground na, mm. na napunta sa ground mm. yung laban most people would think that uh when you're on the ground, you're losing, right? Yeah, yeah. And, but in jiu-jitsu, it's uh, an even field pa rin. Yeah, I really think all, uh, everyone should train it at least six months or a year. Yeah, just basic education, mm-hmm. some basic self-defense. And just six especially months. I mean, kids, no? yeah, especially kids mm-hmm. and uh, women. And yeah, and I, I know it's not popular to say it now because, you know, victim blaming and stuff like that. But mm-hmm. I would, you know, really recommend it. Mm-hmm. Um, but it's fun first of all we live in a in a civilized society and mm-hmm. the chances of getting into a fight or getting mugged is very low but mm-hmm. it's just fun it's really fun and you make lots of good friends yeah it's very it's a lot of fun if you if you like video games and and you know you, you need an exercise uh, jiu jitsu is, is is the sport because you know you you accumulate moves and then you try it out Oh, uh-huh. it failed, but some of it worked, and then you you watch yeah you know you watch YouTube or you go to a seminar mm-hmm. and stuff like that. Uh, you said you attended seminars, but it's more beneficial to you if you actually attend class uh-huh. regularly. So yeah. yung nasa yung yung na, na tutunan mo sa seminars, you can you can practice it sa class. That's mm-hmm. really the key. Eh. Um, repetition, repetition, and, repetition, talaga, and sparring frequently. Grabe. Yeah. Uh, 
uh, one thing that uh, fascinates me talaga about martial arts, mm-hmm. a- any martial art, mm-hmm. uh, whether it's uh, jiu-jitsu or boxing or yeah. uh, Muay Thai, yeah. yung pinaka-badass guy in the gym is also mm-hmm. the... The nicest one, most of the time, no. I don't know, at least in my in my experience, but yeah. he's he's almost always the parang oh, okay, parang uh-huh. ambayet na parang you will. Pero if uh, they're gonna kill you, uh, yeah. if, if they decide to to kill you mm-hmm. on that spot on on that spot, talagang ano eh, parang they can do it with their bare hands, yeah. diba? So pero. I won't go. I think there's something about martial arts and practicing it and uh, mastering the the mm. the art and the how it affects it affects your you know, your your character. I, I would like to think so. I'm I I'm not I'm not a psychologist. Uh, yeah, we don't have the data, but yes. Well, you know, there's some occasionally out of thousands and thousands of black belts. Mm. You know, you'll get a couple who get into the news. And no, then, nga, eh, diba? So it's not really a guarantee, but it's. Um, I think it, the, you know, uh, he has a good track record. Like every day, mm-hmm. um, thousands of gym people choke each other out. Mm-hmm. Basically, when you choke someone, you're being taught how to kill the person. Oh, why? When, the, you, when you hold the choke for like a minute or two, the person's dead. gonna. Is, so yeah, mm-hmm. so they're, they're dead. So mm-hmm. <laughs> you're you're training people. So important rin yung character na you're not. Oh. Really, <laughs> so pag pag may sexual predator dere ka dere nde ba So man. occasionally it happens that they're mo open sa news that there's a oh, shit. Oh, a bad man. person who knows jujitsu and stuff like that. But well, case in point is ano, uh, mm-hmm. I would just like to congratulate powerful Chris Hoffman, you uh, yeah. the no the yes, yes. A, a former guest here uh-huh. in the in the podcast, nice, uh, nice. double champion. Uh, URCC lightweight, light heavyweight, and middleweight champion. He, he nice. just won last uh, Saturday, Saturday night. Mm-hmm. Oh, tapos, uh, when he when he gets in the cage, mm. naka, ano, eh, yung mukhang nakakatakot talaga eh. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Mga hindi mo lalapitan eh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sino to? <laughs> yeah. Pag uh, dumating dito. Pero after, yeah. tapos... You, uh, when he was here, he was so he was so giddy and bubbly, laughing nice. all the time, diba? But that was he's he he just seems to be like the nicest guy. Yeah. Na parang you you'd like to to hang out hang out with, diba? Yeah. Uh, nice, nice. Yun, Congratulations. Uh, uh, si uh, si Chris Hoffman. Kanina yeah. nono siya. I won't nono. <laughs> pero he's based in ano eh. He's based in uh, Switzerland. Oh, nice. Yeah. Uh, nice, pero nice. they fly him back. Buting nga lumalaban pa eh. yeah. I'm sure. Pero that's why ano eh, I'm really fascinated like even Conor McGregor, the mm-hmm. so when, when he's uh he does his all, all of his shenanigans, mm-hmm. diba? Pero w- w- there there would be videos and, and uh interviews of him na seryoso siya. Mm-hmm. He's talking about zen vibes, eh, diba? Uh-huh. He's talking about um uh, confidence. Mm. He's talking about uh, the law of attraction, mm. but at the same time, he can kill you at will. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think, yeah, I think uh, jujitsu, parang imbu- uh, imbues on you some confidence because you know you, you train with with you train live sparring every night. So mm-hmm. yun lang parang yeah yun lang na change namin, parang hindi na ako masadong tense. Pag may altercation, parang okay lang. No, nga, no? Kasi hindi mo na kailangan masyadong ano, parang, hindi mo naisipin, paano mong mangyayari, ano mangyayari, unless na MMA fighter, oh, mo, okay. I mean, kahit white belt yan, basta MMA fighter, it's different, it's different. Ah, yeah. Oh, I mean, man. when punches are involved, and someone has like, six months of jiu-jitsu, even if I outrank him by years, mm-hmm. iba pa rin, yeah, may, I, he could still, ano, oh, but, okay. an untrained person, it's really funny how, what you can do to an untrained person, oh, nga. even with like, six months training, and oh, one nga, year training, nga. it's it's amazing. Kahit nga boxing lang yung gawin mo eh. If, mm. if, uh, if you realize that mm. you get into a fist fight, yeah. and you realize that, oh shit, yeah, this yeah, guy yeah. doesn't know how yeah, to, yeah, yeah, yeah. doesn't even know how to, yeah. uh, parang you guard, mag guard, yeah. doesn't even know yeah. how a proper stance works, mm. diba? Yeah. Parang you can easily play with that person eh, exactly. diba? Yeah. So, same with wrestling and judo. You know, I mean, oh, <laughs> diba? <laughs> Lalo na wrestling at, in concrete, no. Oh my God. Yeah. What, what is your, you know, what is your favorite? No, no, no. No. Do you train ma- many kinds of martial arts? No, just jujitsu. Jiu- 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 yeah, yeah okay. with some, you know, it involves very light, striking, very rudimentary 
uh, wrestling and some very uh, rudimentary striking. Actually, no, uh, striking defense. You know, parang basic uh, mm, cover uh-huh. parang garan. Pero um, no, I'm. It's more like a sports jujitsu um, training. Oh um, yeah, hopefully I don't get to a, get into a real fight. But <laughs> <laughs> Do you plan to compete in the no, future? Ah, nah, really, I'm not. I don't have that, you know, gene to <laughs> to compete and mm-hmm. handle all the stress. <laughs> but I think I have to. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe try more. Try to at least once. I, I have an excuse. Yolo. I'm a professional artist. I don't want to <laughs> break my hand. But... Dun palang sa ano sa setup palang tap ka na. Yeah, that's just an excuse though. I just <laughs> no, 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 can handle the stress. No, I'm sure you can yeah. beat a lot of uh, us guys here. Uh, no, no, I I hope so. No. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a lot of fun, guys. You should try it. Parang mm-hmm. it's so everyone, most most teams naman. I, I think I think it's the same across the board. Uh, friendly, they you know they mm-hmm. they're not. You're gonna take your view, and uh, yeah. It's a weird question. Mm. D- does uh, <laughs> jujitsu apply to art? Because may mga ganong ano eh. Parang sometimes I really don't. Uh, um, art no. Maybe more on more on. Uh, I really don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> That's a short question. Uh, uh, maybe endurance, like you know, sitting uh, in a table for a long time, but. I mean, definitely health. Being physically healthy uh, helps you of course, in no? everything. Like I'm, a, I believe that we are our bodies, and you know, take care of your body. How can you draw when you're, you know, you're unhealthy and you're sick and you know, and your back. Mm-hmm. Uh, we're sitting slouched. Uh, yeah, that's why hours I, a day. So. Kaya ginawa kong ano eh, standing table standing, too, eh, diba? okay. Kaya ano eh. Try to ano, like ako naman not standing, but try to. Maybe let's project your your chest, your uh-huh. chest out and mm-hmm. back straight. Baka ganun. Baka it will mm-hmm. help. <laughs> but yeah, may uh, is there a jiu-jitsu gym, uh, gyms uh, near your your area? Meron sa Elorde, pero more on the shampoo de sa sa boxing. Ah, pero there's ah. a there's a UFC gym, mm. pero ay eh, it's a uh, mga ano eh hindi ko hindi ko kayang lakarin mm. uh, gusto ko kasi yung mga gym na ano ko eh, yung kaya kong lakarin mm. eh pero yeah. that's why let's see uh, maybe <laughs> I'd get a bike a, a bike yeah, <laughs> a, yeah, yeah. a motorcycle Ma- medyo malayo pa rin ano yun eh pa malayo, may, malayo pa din masyado at saka dadaan ka din sa yung dinaan mo kanina ah, okay. medyo, medyo, may, uh, medyo hindi well, kaya-ayang dadaan mag- mag- magamit mo yung <laughs> oh, <nga. laughs> magamit yung bike mo <laughs> Hindi sa mga bike. Hindi, maybe a motorcycle would be, would be better. Yeah. Pero, if uh, if I get that, I'm planning to get one. Mm-hmm. Nga lang, I've never rode a motorcycle before. Uh, at yeah. least driven. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. I mean, key yung ano, consistency and mm-hmm. frequency. Maybe three times a week. Two times a week. Oh, nga. Yeah. Minimum two. Talaga? Two? I mean, that's very minimum. But, so, but yeah, again, whatever it is, you're still better than the version of yourself who doesn't train. So, oh once a week, no. then, it's still better than nothing. Yeah. But ideally, three. If you're competing every day. I mean, if you're plan to compete, be, you know, mm. every day. And <laughs> so, talagang naka, ano yan, naka sama sa... Kasi sometimes, I, I'm also an artist, di ba? Mm. So, uh, hirap na hirap akong i-seeing it sa schedule ko yung, ano eh, yung workout. Parang, ewan ko ah, parang, I'm the kind of artist who needs buelo yeah. bago magsimula, tapos tuloy-tuloy. Yeah, ako rin actually. Diba? Parang, uh, pa- tapos, if I get distracted with working out, mm-hmm. I'm gonna have to reset my buelo time. Yeah. Tapos, ngayon, di lalo ako mawawala ng oras. Yeah, same parang, with me, that's why my gym is a bit near sa house ko, and that helped a lot. Mm-hmm. And it was really, right now, it's walking distance. And also my my friends, my gym, my training partners, they're very encouraging. Mm-hmm. I can train, so you know, I mean, it really helped. But my discipline is, is actually not that great when it comes to physical activities. Mm-hmm. Like I don't train on my own. Like some people, they parang they can train on their own. Like if they're if they yeah. they're away, ah, uh, sorry, if they're away, mm-hmm. um, they would you know self train. They only need like one kettlebell and you know, or mm-hmm. do, even just do body weight exercises. Mm-hmm. Like, I, I really can't do that. So yeah, it, it helped that my gym is near me and you know, I'm friends with Hi. everyone. So so yeah, I, I can't blame you. No. But there are just people that's why they're better than me, eh? Cause they they live kilometers away, like one hour away and they and yet they train every day. So 
Mm-hmm. So that's why you know that's why they're better. Oh. <laughs> that's why they, they they train more. They love it more. They. How how often do you uh, do you draw every day, talaga? No, only when I need to. Like I, I I rarely draw for fun anymore. But you know, but I draw a lot. I draw a lot because it's my it's my it's work. work. Uh-huh. Um. So during crunch time, I would be drawing like let's say four th- four days in a week, mm-hmm. maybe or five. And there are weeks I don't draw, and there are weeks that I draw every day, even Sundays and Saturdays. So it, you know, it fluctuates. Pero before, uh, maybe uh, ganon ka pa, ganon karen parin ba or, or did you used to draw every day? Hmm, draw every day. Um, yeah, I think I spent more time drawing before, mm-hmm. just because I was younger. Yeah. I, See Harvey, well, ano eh, parang he couldn't sit down for one hour without mm, maybe, doodling. Yeah, eh, I think so. Yeah, <laughs> Harvey's um, <laughs> output is quite insane. <laughs> yeah, I think even Kim Jung Ji. Kim. Yeah, that's why he's so good because he draws everywhere he goes. The way mong his sketchbooks have um, scenes where he's just he's sitting in a restaurant and drawing everything. May pagkasavant yung ano eh, dating yeah. ni Kim Jong Gi eh, di ba? Oh yeah. Magkakawa na naman yung friends ko. Ano siya eh, uh, <laughs> tawag dito, uh, parang may photographic memory siya, yung mga mm. parts ng kotse. Mm. So, parang he doesn't need reference yeah, 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 to yeah. how to draw those things. Parang, yeah. ha- paano, paano yung parang napicturean niya talaga? But at the same time, you, ha- you have to ask yourself, how many times did he draw that the oh. car engine mm-hmm. in, his, in his, his like 45 I don't know maybe he's been doing it since 15 or 12 or mechanic talaga siya no? uh, may, may know, background siya sa mga he's you know he's been doing it so many times that mm-hmm. so parang yun, yun pala na-realize ko sa sa jujitsu and art it's really about the time you spend practicing mm-hmm. and drawing so I don't know like I'm, so when you when somebody asks so, ano ba yung ano ano ba yung artistic talent? Is it is it inborn or is it practiced? But at the same mm-hmm. time, oh, nga. maybe it, maybe it's not it's not um, mutually exclusive. Like what drives you to draw every day, ba? Kaya ako gumaling kasi drawing ka every day. Mm-hmm. But what gave you that the compulsion to draw every single day? Mm-hmm. I mean, did you choose it? No, it's it's part of you. It's part of you. That you really want to draw instead of you know instead of playing basketball, you want to draw instead of mm-hmm. doing so, chasing girls. You want to draw. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know. So in the end, it's still you know it's still probably inborn. I don't know, but yeah. it it definitely involves a lot of practice, a lot. And same with jujitsu, a lot of mat time, a lot of mm-hmm. and boxing, a lot of. So you would just say, uh, young uh, the thing that keeps you mot- motivated is. Uh, uh, that uh, that natural instinct, your inborn instinct to draw. Yeah, what keeps me motivated is, I think more also the social aspect of you know being not being forgotten or being oh, yeah, okay. yeah mm-hmm. parang or um, well as, as, aside from economics, which is you know you know yeah. finances, you have to work, right? mm-hmm. um, being. Um, visible to to your peers and and the fan base mm-hmm. and being good, paren, because you know this uh, you know, talent uh, skills could you know could regress if you if you don't practice. Um, but I don't know. It, it's you know w- w- if I you know if I won the lottery, would I still be drawing? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe a few covers a month, <laughs> you know. Uh, Maybe. Gym, gym. Or I don't know, like hang out and <laughs> so maybe a, a huge part of it's economics, Like mm-hmm. you know, it's I'm be, I'm 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 lucky to have this job. So why why would I even you know stop? Yeah. Diba? Parang, oh, so, I, I remember Miko when uh, Miko was here. Mm. Uh, he he told me parang yun yung yun yung natatanda niya sinabi mo <laughs> natatanda niya sinabi mo sa kanya eh, yeah. dude kasi he was a uh, on the edge. Masyado siyang mm. distracted dun sa office namin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, he was uh, parang, ano, magre-resign ba ako? Parang, <laughs> tapos, dude, it's like, you won the, ro- the lottery, di ba? Tapos, uh, Actually. Pero, which is true. Kasi, yeah. if you think about it, um, that's why, you can really say that, uh, lahat ng mga uh, artist in DC and Marvel mm. is probably the best talaga in the world because, mm. Uh, they, 
first of all, they only pick the best. Mm. And there are lots of good artists all over mm. the world and they pick the best among mm. those best of the best. Mm. Right? So it's really parang uh, 0. 0.9 basta uh, 001 bagay uh-huh. <laughs> percent yeah, I mean, ng ano. Il- ilan lang, ilan lang ba kami? Like, it's not, it's konting-konti lang. Do you think there's uh, a 1,000, may 1,000 yung active na roster? Nang? Nang, wala, no? Nang, nang, nang DC? Nang artist sa buong mundo? Mm-hmm. Um, no, yeah, thousands naman. Pero some of them are very like parang nag, konti lang yung work or mm-hmm. nag, gumawa ng cover, nag color, ganun. Kasama na dun yung lahat ng color, lahat ng talents. Ah, okay. Um, hirap eh, parang lately I've been seeing some mediocre art you know, oh nga, oh nga, yeah, no? yeah, doing high profile books which is I don't know why but um, pero marami pa rin mga galing but yeah like even the Philippines um, you would think na marami nang kasunod sila Miko or mm-hmm. sila ano pero konti konti lang naman mm-hmm. so it's not really it's still rare pa rin. it's still a high skill well, I think they 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 also they all also started looking somewhere else, diba? Yeah. Kasi parang maybe but, may mga yeah. artists na sa Africa, diba? May mga artists. Yeah, may ganun, pero ngayon most artists, I think outside of the United States and North America, I think it- Italy, Spain, used to be Brazil and the Philippines, eh, but mm-hmm. I think they they looked uh yeah. And Elsewhere. they're also looking for uh looking at China, but um I saw one good artist, but it's not really. It's like it's not like it's you know, parang concept art na oh there's like hundreds, uh-huh. know, thousands. Of, mm, in comics, it's still quite. It's because maybe it's it's less. Parang siyang ane. What is parang let's say jujitsu. Mm-hmm. So the top tier art, the top tier um, um, athletes, they go. They're not in jujitsu. They are in, in the NBA. Mm-hmm. They do football. So, ganun, baka ganun din sa comic book art. So, the, a lot of artists, they go into concept art. They, they do something else. They well, do games, ta- maybe. Mm-hmm. Kasi comic, konti lang nagbabasa ng comics eh. Mm-hmm. So, baka ganun, may, may ganun factor na... It's not that we're like... I see. The best. Pero konti lang yung nagbabasa ng artists na gusto, mag, gusto mag-comics. Well, I, Kasi kailangan magaling ka rin mag-comics eh. Kailangan mm-hmm. nagbabasa ka rin eh. Yeah. Well, I'm sure... Uh, not, not a lot of... Uh, not all uh, mm. comics artists would be able to effectively create concept art. But at the same mm. time, not all concept artists would be yeah. effective in... Because it's a uh, comic... Uh, the visual storytelling is yeah, a, yeah, yeah. a different the, beast. Yeah, it's, it's, own, um, it's a smaller... It's a smaller industry. It's more difficult. Because you can mahira. you need to draw everything. Like mm. concept art, you need... You can just... You just concentrate on vehicles and you know. Oh, nga, and you can just concentrate on costume. Comics, mm. you have to do everything. Oh, parang you're basically acting, eh, diba? yeah, yeah. You're acting the yeah. the characters. You're Story designing. Yeah. You're you're blocking the scenes, diba? And then the the progression sure. ng mga actions. It could be argued that you're also co-writing it because you're in you know the the script. You're 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 telling the you're telling a story using yeah. the script. And mm-hmm. I would bet that if two artists drew the same script. And it would be drastically different. Mm. Yeah. Oh, nga, no? and that would be interesting to have like well, a single actually, one comic book drawn by different artists. Oh, nga, no? <laughs> well, actually, nakita ko yan kasi there was uh, this uh, project dun sa dating studio sa amin, mm. sa amin ni Namiko. Mm. Magkakasama kami kasi co-workers mm. before. Uh, merong script yung parang yung pinakang boss namin from the US. Meron, silang, meron siyang gustong gawing project tapos pinagawa nagpadala siya ng script yeah. so so may mga gustong mag-try mag, nag-try kami so mm. gum- ako gumawa rin ako mm. tapos saying na namin syempre nung tapos na magkakaiba yung ano eh mm. it's the same story yeah. pero you, you get uh, to see different versions yeah. uh, yung diba yung mga sample scripts din na uh, you can download online diba mm. yung uh, yeah, yeah. there's a popular one eh yung uh, the darkness. <laughs> basta, ah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that, that, uh, diba? Ilang script yun. Tapos, basta, nandun si the darkness at saka yung babae, si, what's what's her name? Ah. Si Lane. Wait, wait. Um, is 
sex. Guys, guys. <laughs> Basta, <laughs> okay. Mark Silvestri character. Oh, right? diba? Yeah. Si The Darkness, tsaka si Lady Le- something. Eh. Oh, Bawad siya nalimutan ko bigla. Guys, sino yun? <laughs> si Lady Death. Lady Death ba yun? Hindi, <laughs> 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 Lady Death Strike ang nais. <laughs> Ano, Plus, si, which which blade? Which blade? Yeah. Yun, 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 which blade? Yeah. So, merong ano eh, tapos may kotse pa, tapos si Darkness na dun sa yeah. likod, di ba? Ilang beses mong nakita, ah, ito yung script na yun, mm. di ba? So, I'm sure a lot of uh, a lot of uh, artists, baka may mga nakikinig, baka may gumawa nun doon. Mm-hmm. So, pe, so, makikita mo yung magkakaiba ng interpretation. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, so, yeah, mas mahirap, mahirap mag-comics. Mm-hmm. Basically, you have to be able to do a lot of stuff. Kahit yung mga ano? Draw everything. Kahit yung mga simpleng scenes lang, di ba? Yeah. It's sometimes even harder. It's even harder to draw so, like talking talking scenes. What's your what's your pinaka hindi gustong gawin na scenes? <laughs> I'm drawing new characters because I have to study them pa. Ah, um, the okay. new costumes. And drawing yeah, talking scenes like ordinary scenes. Oh. D- depends. Like I enjoy it. I sometimes enjoy it, but when it comes to let's say, oh, I don't know, I have to draw like a diner. So boring. Ah, what am I learning to draw a diner? Uh-huh. At the same time, well, there are tricks. You know, you can use uh, 3D models, mm. photographs, and stuff like that. But still, it's a diner. Mm. Um, but I like I do like drawing faces. So conversations aren't really a problem for me. Mm. But some some occasionally it gets boring the, depending on the on the scene. But yeah. <laughs> what, what what are your thoughts about ano, the use of uh, yung mga 3D models? Because may parang iba parang oh, hindi pa, de ba? Um, <laughs> Would scoff at the idea. No, I'm 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 for it, but I just want I just wish that I would prefer not wish because I don't you know my mm-hmm. opinion doesn't really you know, I would rather that they make it look more organic and at least turn it into a you know like a hand drawn thing and still draw over it at least ah, okay yeah but i'm not really against it like no. you know it's re- it's it's been part of the trick since decades ago but before they were just using photographs and oh. photocopy machines mm. like you know so. well, totoo naman talaga eh, yeah. kasi in japan they have other artists doing the backgrounds for example mm-hmm. so but since we're like a one man team or two man team mm-hmm. in comics so we have to do it all our all ourselves so you yeah. know Parang ano, diba? parang, kasi it, you have a deadline to beat. Yeah, I mean, first of all, so parang it's not really a problem. Mm, para a lot of uh, most of uh, yung napapansit ko, a lot of people na nagko-comment against it mm. or yung mga hindi professionals, eh, diba? Yeah, yeah. Kasi the ano yan. But you have to you have to know your perspective too because you can you can still screw it up like you have a 3D oh, model <laughs> and you don't know how to place the the character. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Or yeah, I mean, it's really up to you. If the if the readers don't like it, then it's mm. you have to adjust. Oh, okay, they don't. It, it looks too 3D. It looks too, you know, uh, mechanical. So and, yeah. and sometimes, cause yung let's say uh, a motorcycle, de ba? Mm-hmm. Kasi pag-aralan mo pa mm-hmm. yung bawa yung underbelly ng ano ng uh, yung under yung diko yung ilalim ng sasakyan, de ba? Mm-hmm. Tapos, di mo alam kung initsura nun. Or oh, let's yeah, say, yeah. a specific uh, a, a specific car, di ba? Mm. Na model ng car. Yeah. Sabihin mo, parang ano yan, parang uh, Audi na, yung kay Iron Man, yeah. na, na Audi niya. Mm-hmm. Tapos, hindi naman ganun yun eh, di ba? Yeah. Dapat, kailangan mo talaga ng, ano, ng uh, accurate na basehan. Yeah, yeah, of course you need references. Um, I'm, I'm torn between, because you could, uh, like, like, for me, I stop at, ano, I, I never, like, my humans are always, you know, uh, hand drawn completely. Mm-hmm. But, oh, ano ba yung what 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 makes it wrong to to use like poster or you know, mm-hmm. 3D models or pictures? Mm-hmm. Um, aside from let's say the 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 creative rights of the photographer, blah blah. blah. Let's yeah. remove that for first. Let's say merong mga stock photos that you can use. No, okay. So what stops an artist from from using them? Mm-hmm. Wala. It's the readers. Who keep if they keep buying it then you mm. know why you know why why would this artist stop using photographs? No, oh, no. Like, uh, diba, si, yeah. uh, there's one artist na yeah, yeah. famous na si, si Greg Land, yeah, yeah, diba? yeah. Si so, Greg Land, so his work is still very popular and art, people keep buying his work. So why would he stop? Oh, nga, diba? So yun lang. I mean, yeah, of course the the original artists and the original models, the original photo uh, photographers that he swiped from. They would have a problem with it, but it seems like the readers are—they mm-hmm. don't care. 
Tsaka yung editors probably don't care kasi they, kaya nga na publish eh, yeah, They need it. They need, they need fast and reli- re- reliable. Yeah. No, no. no. Yeah. Uh, ta- ang uh, problema kasi na sinisita siya is uh, so he swiping fo- from photos. Mm-hmm. Uh, pero yung mga sinwipe niya na gagamitin niya ulit. Ah, diba? yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. <laughs> pero bakit? Why not? Diba? Yeah, why, people keep buying his stuff. So, I really don't know. I'm, I'm torn. I don't know. <laughs> uh, well, sa, sa amin naman, uh, I, I do that all the time kasi I, mm. I just do storyboards. Mm. So, sometimes, una-una, hindi naman nakikita ng mga tao. Yeah, yun, yeah, yeah. Diba? So, and the storyboards uh, deadlines are are uh, talagang deadly. <laughs> mm, yeah. So, you're gonna need the uh, Basta minsan one day mo lang kailangan. Yeah, so, yeah. Diba? so, so you, you use you, parang yeah. ano, stand-ins and mga ganon. Sometimes picture na mm. license. You can, you can use naman kasi ano lang naman, mock-up, mga ganon ba? Oh, or, or sometimes, uh, let's say, mm. you need uh, a, f- a photo of, mm. uh, of uh, let's say, a woman mm. walking. Mm. Pero you have the, na may nakita kang picture na on the exact pose, pero iba yung damit kailangan ayusin mo na lang yung mm, damit niya mm, pero the, at least the the figure is mm, already set yeah, ba- yeah. babaguhin mo na lang so well, it's not it's not for publishing naman so yeah. it's mm. fine <laughs> <laughs> so yun ano anong uh, ilang oras na tayo huh. uy wa- mag 2 2 hours two na tayo 2 hours na ba <laughs> <laughs> so teka magagalaw lang tayo uh Ano pa bang mga... Hey guys, may... Baka, ano pa baka ba? natulog na sila. Hindi, may nanonood pa. 23. Madadagdagan pa yan. Madadagdagan pa yan while... May, um, teka, uh, meron bang sumali sa... Ano, sa we, have a, we have a giveaway again from uh, Comic Odyssey. Uh, just... Uh, just... Uh, share this live stream. Teka, pakita natin ang ang FB page ng Comic Odyssey. Shout out pala kay Anna Bernabe. Oh, yeah. Ay, ano. So, ah, ito yung uh, drawing ni Miko. Miko, eh, nanonood si Miko. Ewan mo kung ngayon lang yata nanonood. Pero, uh, Comic Odyssey is having, participating uh, as usual in Free Comic Book Day uh, on May May the 4th. May the 4th? Bibig. Parang yun lagi yung Free Comic Book Day, no? Mm, May 4th. Mm-mm. I think so. Ito, arang, arang, arang. Yeah. so. Ano nang timestamp natin? Um, for na uh one forty two, one hour forty two minutes. Ah, uh, abalang pa. Uh, eto. Hindi hindi giveaway yung Thanos to lakin to. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so uh, do, yung giveaway is a book by uh, Lionel Liu. Di ko alam eh, Avengers something. N- n- nalimutan ko yung sinabi ni. Sir Sandy. Mm. Uh, pero unfortunately, I was not able to uh, get it t- before the podcast. So, hindi niya masasignan. Mm. I'm sorry <clears throat> about that. Um, paano kaya? Basta, i-share nyo to and then screen cap your post and uh, post it on the uh, TPKP page. To, uh, tapos mamimili kami. Check nga natin kung meron. <laughs> teka <laughs> lang ha, teka lang. Check natin. Uh, dito, dito, dito tayo. Naglolo ko yung mouse ko eh. Sorry ah. May sumasali ba? Okay, sumali kayo. Sayang yun. Oo nga. 23 people. <laughs> <laughs> Mukhang wala na namang sumasali. <laughs> Bahala kayo. Sa akin na lang yun. Ayun. Ah, si Carlo. Mukhang sumali. Ayun, yung mga nag-share. I-screen cap nyo lang ang, uh, ang post nyo. Tapos, i-post nyo dito sa sa Facebook page. Wala akong pinned post ngayon. So, hindi ko makikita yan. Uh, I mean, so dun yun na lang sa community dito, oh, sa community part. Basta, mag-post mag, uh, lang kayo dun. Write a post. And then, dito lalabas yan sa community. Nye, wala. Walang sumasali. <laughs> Naku. Sa akin na lang. Kayo, guys. <laughs> Pero, basta. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, ano, pag walang sumali ngayon, I'm gonna announce... Kasi wala akong hmm. wala akong nailagay na ano eh. Usually kasi naglalagay ako ng pinned ah. pinned uh, comment eh. Okay so that they'd see. 
Uh, anyway, so there. Uh, ano pa? <laughs> Pag-uusapan ba natin yung endgame? <laughs> endgame. Ganda guys. <laughs> so, tingin ko marami pa hindi nakakanood. Siguro mga oh, sa okay. friends ko, mga 20% pa hindi nakakanood. Talaga? So, so pero man. a non-spoiler, <laughs> ano, a non-spoiler insight lang. Uh, Siguro since, lahat ng, ano, feeling ko lahat ng nakikinig nito, nanood na. Nanood na. So, nanood okay na. na yan. Oh, sige. Okay. So, yeah. So, so uh, as I've said, it's probably the best movie experience I've ever had. Be- mm-hmm. Just because, I don't know, like, not just a comic book fan, pero, Sobrang ganda lang for me. Mm-hmm. Although, yeah, maraming <laughs> questions sa uh, time travel stuff. Uh-oh. So, medyo magulo. Nagugulo na ako dun. But still, it's really mind-blowing how good it is. Mm-hmm. Like, hindi ko expect honestly. Kasi ganda-ganda na ako sa ano eh. Infinity War. Sa Infinity War. Mm-hmm. Just, dito, mas parang sobrang ano. They, they ano eh, parang outdid the uh, pa. Yeah. Well, in terms of, uh, in terms of uh, yung, wow, di ba? Yung parang shit. Parang it's a, uh gaito lang yung during the mm. the final showdown mm. lahat ng kailangan ano well, i think i was also lucky na mm. yung pinanoodan kong cinema is uh, filled with a lot of uh, MCU fans mm. so they're reacting correctly mm. on the scenes on uh, how they're supposed to react yeah, yeah, di ba yeah. kasi meron na kung yung, uh, yung iba parang natatawa doon sa ibang ano eh parang gag sa kanila yung pag-snap ni Thanos biglang wala. Uh, <laughs> diba? Parang parang teka, parang hindi ka man dapat tumawa doon eh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> diba? So tapos uh, ano siya uh, so uh, yung experience mas na-amplify kasi may may kasama kang yeah, nag-aano eh. Yeah. At saka hindi ka mahihiya ngayon na makisigaw. Mm. Diba? Na when you're shouting parang ah! I was, oh. I was, uh, I was uh, screaming literally. Yeah. Thank you nga kay Jiggy pala for um, giving me a slot dun sa ano niya. Kasi parang meron siyang private uh, showing sa 24 mismo. So, really? Jiggy Cruz. Oy, invite na natin siya dito mag, mag uh, ultimate End game podcast tayo. Uh, sino ba? Sino bang ano? Si Miko <laughs> nagyaya eh. Si Miko. Si Miko. Miko. <laughs> ano, game tayo si Carlo Pagulayan ini invite ko eh. Uh, Kasi nandoon siya sa Red Dragon. Oh, ano, oh, nga no, marami Na, siyang ano, marami. Oh, di ba? Marami siyang ano, di ba? Yeah. Si, tapos which all fit noon. Yep, yep. Subukan natin si kahit ano tayo dito, no. <laughs> kahit uh, ilan. Medyo masikip lang pero. Hindi <laughs> 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 nakaano na lang tayo kahit nakasalampak na lang. <laughs> Pero, uh, pero sa, um, ano pa, uh, well, ang isang nakita kong criticism is that uh, uh, about Thanos, mm-hmm. parang hindi siya, parang Thanos in Infinity War was basically almost, uh, ano eh, um, unanimous na yung mga na- napanood ko sa, ano eh, sa YouTube na probably the, the best villain. Mm-hmm. Ang pwede lang contender is uh, uh, tawag doon si Joker with uh, mm. Dark Knight uh, yeah. Dark, basa eh, sa Dark Knight uh-huh. series na Joker pero for me mas okay yung Thanos eh kaya, uh-huh. kaya nabili ko to eh uh-huh. <laughs> so, so ano yung con- con- contention nila parang sa, ano eh and... Thanos used to be that uh, a very well written villain mm. in Infinity War mm. and then uh, it was uh, he was reduced to uh parang almost like parang si apocalypse na lang siya uh, ano. pero, pero I think what they did is ano eh uh, uh, in Infinity War parang they needed they made Thanos the almost the protagonist of that movie eh yeah. diba siya yung ginawang ano bida mm. tapos ngayon it's uh, the Avengers yeah. time na maging bida so yeah, sila yeah. so, parang ano actually sobrang nagusto ko na si, parang, ka, parang naging benign na si Thanos sa akin Diba, okay. naging, diba, naging farmer Thanos na parang medyo uh-huh. medyo naging yeah eh, hindi na siya scary and then, and then sa sa end game parang bumalik na realize ko na sobrang scary na na villain pala si Thanos during his ano yung peak ng ano niya yung drive niya to to do to do what he wanted to do mm-hmm. so I really liked it actually yung treatment it's scary again and, oh yeah, and, yeah, yeah it's really, actually actually yun, yeah, gut wrenching yung ano, yung yung Thanos. Actually yung na reveal na yung lumabas siya na yung nalaman nila na 
yung link pala si Nebula and her yung past self. Mm-hmm. So, sobrang kinilabutan ako sa scenes na yun. Bakit? Kasi parang yun nga, parang, shoot, ang galing ng twist ng ginawa nila. Parang, kala mo, kala mo comedy lang, time travel. Mm-hmm. Pukunin yung, yung stone. Mm-hmm. So, yung pala, napakalaking, ano, complication, which is Thanos traveling in time. Which, uh, through, you know, tra- traveling through the their time machine. So, mm-hmm. I don't know, I, I just thought it was amazing what they did. So, Galing, no? Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> ang, uh, siguro, for me, uh, ang pinakang main criticism ko doon, pero I understand naman, kasi I'm also, I also write. Mm-hmm. So, pero the choice lang of what they uh, did to Thor, mm-hmm. parang, uh, parang, ba't mo naman ginanon? <laughs> ba't mo naman ginanon yung uh, character, di ba? Parang, mm. pwede namang iba eh. Bakit, dun, why did you have to go to that direction that uh, you basically made him a loser, di ba? Kasi, nag- basically, naging ganun siya eh. Parang, uh, at, uh, at the end of Ragnarok, he was, uh, his, uh, parang yeah. nasa ano eh, yung, yeah, yeah. yung spirit niya as Thor was fully revived eh. Ta- revitalized siya na yeah. he's the king of Asgard and he yeah. just uh, dis- uh, saved his own people. And then a few years later, para ah, si, si na yan. <laughs> I think it was um, I think it was important to show that that he was remorseful about you know mm. uh, chopping off the heads. Para important yata siya na ano, na kailangan medyo ma ma, ma na affect talaga siya dun sa ano because you know it's a, still a PG thirteen movie. I, I don't know ano ba yan? PG thirteen. PG thirteen. So yeah, but. Like for me, I, I don't I don't think I would have a problem with it if I you know, like, was Thor. I don't know. Kasi, but kasi, I think yeah. Is Thor's uh, contract is Chris Hemsworth contract done with? Uh, I, I don't know. Hindi hindi ba yata, di ba? Hindi part pa. part na siya ng ano ngayon? As guardian. <laughs> so yeah, I think it was important, but at the same time, may complain yata na parang comic relief. Mm-hmm. dahil overweight siya parang ganon. Oh nga. Yun, I no? I thought it was fun. Sorry, but I'm sorry to my. <laughs> uh, I think it was great. Talaga. Honestly, well, it's so it's okay yeah, naman. Yeah. For me lang, uh, like I said, I probably wouldn't write it that way, uh, ba? Pero maybe uh, uh, I don't know. Si Hawk lang parang underwhelming. Oh nga, eh. kasi parang they had to nerf these so, ano eh. Sobrang nerf na siya sa Infinity War. Tapos dito parang hindi rin siya masyadong ano, oh, effective. Eh. Eh. 'Yun ang isang pinakang ano ko, pinakang pinaka sigurong malaking what the fuck oh, is parang Hulk needed to be saved yeah. by Ant-Man sa Rubble. Wala siyang nagawa. Di ba? Uh, wala <laughs> parang, siyang, hindi ko tulad nung, nung Avengers na I'm always angry. Di ba? Diba? Ha- are you kidding me? Si Hulk yeah. to eh. But why does he need to be, ano? He's supposed yeah. to be a world breaker. Di ba? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tapos ngayon, parang he, he, he can't go out, get out of the Rubble. Yeah. <laughs> para, di ba? Tapos hawak-hawak siya ni, ni, ni Ant-Man. Uh, tapos, yeah. yun nga, parang si, ano, uh, and then, yeah, si Hawk ay hindi mamatay-matay. <laughs> basically, an ordinary person. So. Oo nga. Well, kasi nawala yung, uh, kasi, di ba, sa comics, uh, yung power ni Hulk hmm. comes from uh, the more angry he gets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ngayon, nawala yung anger niya. Uh, di ba? Kaya hindi na siya <laughs> insufficient funds bigla siya yeah, but when it comes yeah. to, ano. <laughs> yeah, wala siyang, yeah. Eh, medyo, sana meron siyang isang scene na matindi. Oh, nga eh. at, at least, he could have even the score with Thanos kasi he yeah. got his ass whooped t- yeah, yeah. The, sa, ano, sa, sa beginning ng Infinity yeah, so, War. Yeah, so wala siyang, ano, sa Infinity War. <laughs> but yeah, it's, it's, it's mind-blowing, that, that movie. It's probably gonna be a classic for a long time. Yes. Sabi nga yeah. ng ibang reviewer, ano eh, uh, ibang reviewer sabi, this is gonna be parang studied in film classes so parang Maybe. You know. I mean this is probably the the, the way Star Wars is with us mm-hmm. uh, in 20 years no the yeah. Avengers yeah grabe <laughs> napabili nga ako nito eh mm. kasi this is the scene where ano eh where Thanos uh, parang I think uh, his uh, greatest display of power mm. during Infinity War aside from the snap of yeah, course yeah. diba Pero dito sa ano, eto. <laughs> Ngayon, pinagsisisihan ko na. Right, right, right. <laughs> eh, syempre, gastos siya. Eh. <laughs> Pero nung una siya, kamara maganda to. <laughs> Worth it. <laughs> what else? Uh, well, well tingin ko rin, parang they needed to uh, get these, uh, the the strongest characters a little, they, they need to clear the way for mm. the new, for the new, 
characters na ipapasok na for Phase 4. Like, uh, Captain Captain Marvel, di ba? Mm. Think ko parang overpowered naman masyala si Captain Marvel. Overpowered, do you think, pero do you think? nakalaban pa rin si, ano, si Thanos. Oo oh, nga eh. Diba? Almost. Pero, they, pero he had to yeah, to get yeah. the power stone, yeah, yeah, yeah. di ba? That's true. Pero when he headbutt, uh, parang, tapos nakagano na lang siya. <laughs> <laughs> How about ano? Uh, who do you think is the strongest uh, MCU Avenger? Wala. Captain Captain Marvel. Captain Marvel. Di ba? I mean, overpowered. I think. Oh nga eh. And then Pero Thor. Y- you think? Uh, yeah. uh, you think uh, Doctor <clears throat> Strange? Could because uh, ibang iba naman yung ano ni Doctor Strange. Eh. Yeah. Maybe Doctor Strange. Avenger ba siya? I think. Oh. I. I del del yeah. Basically, yeah. Basically, Lahat yeah. Lahat naman na nandun, Avenger. Mm. Tama, tama, tama. So, yeah. si... Thor? Thor. Thor, parang hindi eh. Parang <laughs> na ano eh. Especially now that he's uh, kind of broken. He's not the, ano, <laughs> hindi parang, siya... hindi, parang may, may mental handicap siya. Uh, hindi na siya broken. Paano na siya? Ano? But, parang naka-recover niya na siya. Ah, talaga? Hindi, <laughs> <laughs> wala lang. <laughs> But, he's making jokes again and stuff like that. <laughs> Ayaw nga, ano, yeah, after, yeah. after. Yeah. Pero... He left the, ano, he left the, well, he basically, parang, inanan niya yung, yung, ano niya, tawag doon, yung pagiging hari niya. Mm. With, uh, yeah. So, so, But yeah, so, huwag niya natin po kasapin yung time travel kasi <laughs> sobrang gulo. Nagugulan ako. Ayaw ka ng, ano, ayaw ka ng, <laughs> medyo complex. Oh, nga. Uh, or yeah. complex or full of holes. I don't know. <laughs> How about the send-offs of, uh, of the main characters? What Sana are, lang, ah, uh, nga ba? Sa, parang unnecessary na nawala pa si Gamora. Dapat so, kasama na lang siya sa as Guardians. Ah. Di ba? Parang kahit na hindi sila ni Quinn, mm-hmm. you know. Dapat, parang tumakas yata siya after the oh, battle. Oo, eh, parang, no? eh, but kaya. Sa kaya siya Siguro part na ng story yun. Mm-hmm. Send-offs. Yeah, I, I really found the Captain America thing uh, interesting. Uh, yung he decided to grow old. Mm-hmm. But confusing yung ano, na sa timeline pala nila nangyari yun. Parang, what? Sana, kala ko kasi alternate timelines, di ba? Mm-hmm. So, as I've said, yung pag-usapan yung uh-huh. travel. But okay yung, okay yan na tumanda siya. Tumanda siya. Mm-hmm. Parang, yun Sana yun, lang, mm-hmm. dumaan pa rin siya sa time machine in some way. Ano It's, gagawin niya after? Ibig sabihin, sana, sana lang, parang ang lumalabas kasi, dun, nandun pala siya all along sa universe na yun. Ah, yung old, yeah, di ba? Yeah. Kasi mm-hmm. parang hinintayin niya lang matapos lahat. Mm-hmm. Oo oh, nga. So, na-confuse ako dun sa part na yun. So he he stood by the sidelines. Oh, uh, ganun. And then may asawa, 'di ba? Kala ko may asawa si Peg. So uh, anong nangyari dun sa ano, para sinabi niya na lang na ah, wag na kayong pumunta diyan sa ano, diyan sa diyan sa mga yelo. Uh, <laughs> 'Di ba? Don't dig him up. But maybe he sabotaged the missions para uh, ma, ma, ma so the the Captain America yeah. uh na uh, may isang Captain America na nasa buried under the ice pa rin. Mm. <laughs> Tsaka di ba, ano, tawag doon, they're trying to return the stones to, the, to their respective times. Oo oh, nga. Para saan? Kasi, mas maganda nga, wala na yung stones eh. Para hindi na makuha ng Thanos, ni Thanos eh. Mm. So, mas maganda nga, di ba, na hindi na oh, nila binalik. Ano? Kasi, w- what are the stones for? They're absolutely useless. I mean, not useless, but, wala. Ginamit lang siya ni Thanos. So, it's better na, na wala siya. Mm. Na wala sila. Eh, at saka, ha- How did he? Di ko alam ha. It's not clear to me. Kung saan niya binalik yun dun sa timeline yung stones. So pumunta siya sa Asgard. Tapos yeah. nilagay siya don. Yeah. Bute yeah. alam niya. Yeah. <laughs> Bute I alam mean, niya kung saan siya pumunta. Kasi binigyan, binigyan siya ng notes ni ano ni Thor. <laughs> De ba? Yeah. Pumunta siya sa ano? Pumunta. Paano yung Soul Stone? Yeah. Di nagawa sila ni ano? ni pangalan ito. Hindi naman. Like, parang nangyari doon. Like, when when Hawk left with the... Ah, yan yeah, ni Red. Ni oh, Red no? Skull, di ba? <laughs> Awkward, no? Di ba? Parang... Para, oh, di ba? Malamang nag... nag uh... Awkward. Di ba? So, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. ha? Di ba? Yeah, yeah. At, at saka, what would be the procedure on on returning the Soul Stone? Kasi, to yeah. get it, you need... You need... Right. Uh... Iwan niya lang talaga. Ah, baka, baka maybe to... to return it, you need to... To uh, sacrifice your enemy, enemy naman. Bilatay so, pinatay niya si... <laughs> pinatay niya si Red Skull. Siya yung hinulog niya doon. ba? Diba? Uh, Tapos ngayon, may i-return niya na. Pero, wala nga point eh. Ba't niya i-return ba? 
para to fix the timeline. Ano bang fixed timeline? Kasi mas better off nga yung worlds na yun without Thanos. So malalaman ni Thanos, shit, wala na yung stone. So ano gagawin ko? Plan, ibang plan na lang, parang ganun. Oo oh, nga, you know. So yeah. So <laughs> they have to redo the movie. <laughs> okay. No, oh, nga. Pero pero at least we had that ano, we have that uh, conclusion. What whatever wherever um Marvel or Disney takes the franchise uh, here forward mm. parang we have this classic talaga yeah. na parang it was uh, satisfactorily even more than satisfactory no, eh pa, pa, yung uh, yung book end yeah. nung franchise na yun, mm. or the saga is uh, secured yeah. hindi mo na pwedeng galawin yan sobrang ganda like for me sobrang ganda siya um, emotionally Oh no. Yeah. And um um yeah, grab it. Like the ten ten years of, of great cinema from, from one single studio. It's amazing how they did it. Oh, I mean diva. Out of twenty movies, ilan lang yung medyo so so tatlo lang apat lang yata or ganun. Wait, yeah. anong, ano bang mga so so Iron Man three, diba? Yeah. <laughs> yung Thor Dark World. Dark World. Sino ba ba? Uh I wasn't a fan of Doctor Strange. Ah, talaga? Pero, okay. Yeah. I mean, okay. Not, 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 pero gusto ko yung dalawang Ant-Man, gusto Dele. ko yung, mm. gusto ko yung Thor, Ragnarok, sobra. Pinanood ko kasi yung Doctor Strange mm. sa, sa ano, 4DX. Mm. So, so, gumagalaw, yeah, yeah. gumagalaw, that was 3D, that was ang ganda yeah. ng, ano, ang ganda ng uh, sound. So, parang, yeah. pero yan, so, I think it enhanced yeah. yan the lang, movie. Iron, Iron Man 3, Dark World, Ano ba bang ikaw? Ano ba bang? Uh, maybe The Hulk. The first uh, Hulk. Yung, uh, Kasi yun nga eh. Yun Marvel eh. Studios pala yung Hulk. No. Yung okay, kay... Uh, no. What's his name? The actor? Uh, Edward, Edward Norton. Norton. Oh. Marvel, Marvel Studios pala yun. Mm-hmm. Yun lang hindi ko alam. Diba? Overlook nga yun eh. Nga nga eh. Kala ko kasi hindi Marvel Studios kasi hindi, hindi ganun kaganda. <laughs> Maganda yung first half niya. Uh. For sure. Like gustong gusto ko. Yung sa, Bra- sa Brazil ba yan? Tama ba yun ba yan? Hindi ko, actually, limot na limot ko na eh. Nagahalo na yung movie oh, sa akin. Eh. Actually, yun lang ang, yeah. I think that's the only Marvel movie mm-hmm. na dito sa saga na to na hindi ko pinanood sa sinehan. Yeah, pero sa, sa konti lang. Everything else is uh, really good. Like, I enjoyed Captain Marvel. And even yeah. those that uh, parang ano, yung Thor, Thor Dark World, parang, Okay na rin. <laughs> Mataas kasi standard natin. Oo nga eh, di ba? Parang, parang day led uh, us na ano eh, na ah, ang ganda ng Iron Man 1. Yeah, yeah. Di ba? Tapos pagdating nag-deteriorate, nang nag-deteriorate. So yan, yung Iron Man 3, yung bakit pwede palang hindi siya nakasakay sa loob ng armor. So bakit pa siya ever, di ba? Kung oh, susuot ng armor, pwede naman niyang gawing drone na lang. Oh, Why would he endanger his life? He could do it remotely. Oo oh, nga. There's really no need. Dapat hindi nila ginawa yan. Oo oh, nga. And, and also, Sana may mga yung mga army of uh, Iron Man niya. Pin- oh, so sinala sana, niya doon sa, sa end game, no? Oh, sana 'yon, 'di ba? Diba? Sana yung mga 'yon. Oh, dapat never nangyari yung free. <laughs> Oo nga. Pero um hindi pa rin ako makaano doon sa ano eh, sa twist no kay Mandarin, parang. Mm, no, parang, ah, sayang na. 'Di ba? Ang ganda na eh. Dapat they could have just sayang. the Ang ganda lang nung, ka, nung actor na yun eh, yeah. They just made it a gag yeah. para reduce the, that uh, yeah, yeah. setting yeah. into a gag. Sa 2 ba yun? 3 din ba yun? I think 3 yun. 3 yun. Yung extremist yun, di ba? Ay, hindi. 2. 2. 2 yun. Two yun. Two, uh, two. Which is, which is uh, decent. Pretty mm. Okay naman yung 2. Mm. Okay naman. Yeah. <laughs> so, ano, <laughs> are we gonna... Yeah. Two, two hours, oh, three baka, minutes. <laughs> wala, wala nang sa atin. Thank you so Meron much ba? for inviting me here. Oh, thank you so I much. Hindi na bore, hindi mo bore yung mga ano mo. Ah, hindi. No, no, no. Hindi, you know, uh, hindi siya... Uh, <laughs> Informative lang ako, pero hindi ako entertaining. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, I'm sure they appreciate it. And uh, aside from that... Uh, Madaming madami talagang naghihintay sa iyo na mag, ano, Madami you're one of the most requested. Thank you sa mga 20 uh, people na nanood. <laughs> uh, Madadagdagan pa 'yan sa ano sa well, yung the thing with uh, YouTube kasi uh, and Facebook is uh, hindi siya ano eh yung algorithm niya is mm. uh, parang they constantly change it. Nung una uh, mag-post ka like like right now I mm. have 
2,600 followers. Mm. Swerte ka na pag nag-post ka na umabot ng 500 yung reach nun eh. Or mm. baka 500 na. Ah, talaga? Oo. Oh, now, without doing anything, ah, mm. or without, uh, unless madaming nagla-like or mm. madaming nag-share, mm. di ba? Uh, pero yung, uh, it even became worse eh, mm. right now. Kasi lalong, basta, yeah. pa, kasi ang ginawa daw ng Facebook is, it is prioritizing family interactions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hindi na yung ano, hindi na yung entertainment mm. and especially news. Mm. Kaya madaming ano eh, na lay off na members ng BuzzFeed ng mga mm. kung ano ano kasi dahil dahil bumaba yung kita nila because yeah. of Facebook's uh, algorithm. Yung gusto nilang ano, uh, gusto nila yung, yung gusto ng advertisers, family oriented. Oo. Oo, uh, ganoon. Kasi they're ano eh parang iniiwasan nila yung controversies mm. na ano yun, you yeah. know the political climate in the US yeah, yeah, yeah. diba eh syempre US pa rin ng ano nila <laughs> that's true ang uh, main uh, main market anyway thank uh, you <laughs> hope to uh, uh, have you again one of these days yes <laughs> we'll try the no. As you I can't promise but you know, that's interesting you know. pero uh, parang you know nat- natouch na natin yung <coughs> end game so yeah, so, oh. sila Carlo naman, saka sila... Ah, sige, sige. Nico, <laughs> sige. <coughs> okay, okay. Alright. So, that's it, guys. Thank you, Lai Liu. Thank you so much. Thank you so Lai much. Lai Liu, finally. in the house, finally. Powerful Comics Man Podcast. Gross at me, ayun. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Teka, teka, hindi ko lang mahanap. Okay, <coughs> one, two, three. Oh, wow, ayaw. Ayaw kang paalisin, bro. <laughs> Oy, roll and credits. Ayaw. Bakit ayaw? Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, Ayan! Go! <laughs> <laughs>